Okay, for those that are not here, we're at episode 3. So we killed the farmers, both of them, at the farm. We survived. That was episode 3. Long road ahead. Looks like this is our lucky day. I don't like it. Keep your eyes open, all right? Just trying to be optimistic. Let's just get inside. Smaller camera? There you go. Oh, man. You made up your mind yet? About what? When it comes to the getting the hell out of Macon, I bet you're in the let's stay put camp considering I've been pushing everyone to leave. Should go. We should go. The motel's run its course, and it's not safe. Well, if that's what you think, you should probably fucking speak up. Lily's dug in. He's gonna remember that. Okay. Was that to do with anything? Just like last time. Over the rig, into the pharmacy, and scrape together whatever supplies are left. We didn't leave much in there. Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. Shit. You okay? The ladder's come loose. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. No kidding. Do I have to go up the fucking ladder? Don't be a pussy boy. Come on. Looks like she's had it. What now? I'll find another way up. Better get a move on. They're blocked by all the fallen concrete. The can? There's a no ramp safe way through that mess. There it is. Kenny, come on. Ah, shit. Damn it. I can't reach. S since when is Kenny such a pussy? Now. All right, stay put. Am I supposed to like stack something on it? Like, like Jenga Tower? There's no way he can push this on, a, on his own, right? Dude, what the fuck? What's blocking it? Hmm. They're blocked by all the fallen concrete. Hmm. hmm. Right here, right here, found it. I, fa I, I found it, I found it, I found it. There you go, baby. Lily's not doing so good, huh? I didn't say shit. Yeah, I saw, I saw checks. I want to see if, if there was spoilers so mod could... Did all this engineering for a truck? Are you serious right now? Your girl still upset with me for taking stuff out of that car last week? I hope not. Hope it ain't worth a damn. Kenny is like 
Both nice and Doug vicious. Doug was asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. Really? That wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. What'd he say? He wanted to know if Herschel's son somehow made it. Pretty sure he knows he didn't. Don't worry. You made out like a hero in his eyes. It's not like that. You're sure you're up for this? Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. Come on. Uh, oh, ha, shit! What the hell happened? Thought you said you could handle it. Have you ever been shot before? I'm sorry. For Christ. You think you... What the fuck is this? Somebody help me! Oh god! Oh god! What the, what the hell is that? Just run? Walkers don't scream, do they? Jesus, I don't think so. It's a girl. She's gonna get us killed. No shit. Dead. Out of this mess. You know we're here. What do you mean? I mean, we leave her alive and she draws them all to her, buying us time. Easy. Think about it. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. Don't fucking do it. Exit. Hell no. Screaming, man, chill out. We should be good to clear this place out, but we ain't got all day. Get everything you can out of these racks. Don't forget underneath the counter this time. I'll clear down here and then we gotta go. Matches? Bottle? Snacks? Snackies? Baby food? Pop tarts? Wipes, juice. She's gone. There's not much time now. Medicine box. Oh, I have to speed on this. No, there's that guys. I fucked it up. It's bugged! I thought it's bugged! Oh, we have a lot of supplies. Come on, Lee! Up and over. You're still clear. You! Get the fuck out of my shit! E? Fridge. Fucking hose. What's up? Let's fucking get out! Wasting bullets, then's game. Again.
carry yourself, didn't you? I did. Yeah, Kenny be became a weird champ because we didn't steal with him. He's mad that we didn't steal with him. Ben found some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. Hey, sweet pea. That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. Walkie-talkie. Wee! <laughs> Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. Ha. Huh. <gasps> the R word. So, what did you get? Nothing. Didn't get anything. <laughs> Lee must have thumped his head out there or something. We got lots. Take a look. We're fine, by the way. Nice work. This will keep us going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze our asses off here. Because piling into an RV with you after what you did to my dad is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. Take a look at the wall. Where'd they go? That's not graffiti. Those are bullet holes. And we got enough arrow shafts sticking out of it to dry our laundry. We have to go eventually, Lily. I know, Lee. I know. Eventually is different. At it again, are we? Can it, Carly. Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. And I don't think you're capable in- We're strongest together. I know you think I'm on her side, but there are no sides, damn it. True. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. No, because Lee knows how to take care of people, not just things. What about medicine? What about medicine? We deal with shit as it comes, just like we always do. And when 15 bandits hop over that wall in the middle of the night? What then? You just gonna deal with that? Everything that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. Do you know how we got these supplies? Your pal and I got lucky and let a girl get eaten out there. What? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. Snitching, She gave us enough time to get everything we could out of the drugstore. And you just let her suffer like what? Like bait? God, what is happening? She was dead anyway. It made the most sense in the moment. Lee's right. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. You should be thanking Lee for not shooting that girl. It's not so easy for him. Look, Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth. And it's coming. This way. It's not going to be easier out on the road! How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right. Stealing! And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day! Now everybody get out! Who stole? She'll get over it. She's uh, riling everybody up otherwise. You understand, Ken. All I know is, whenever this shit happens, I'm the fucking bad guy. I'd like a thank you for once. For once! Oh, the cry baby, the baby rage. Oh, things are coming to a head. You could say that. Well, I think you did good today. And I find myself thinking that most days. Thanks. It's probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying about missing supplies. 
With her wound up the way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. You know what I would do? I would get as many people as I, as I, as I can in my squad and never like turn back. People always get more and more and more. I would work with a rating system, right? If you get food and shit, you get more points and more rating. And if you're too low rated at some point, you get kicked out or killed. I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. Did you come in here to give me hell or to coddle me? Mm. You have to chill out. I know. I'm trying. I'm trying. I just I feel like a crazy person. Can I do anything for you? Yes. I need help. Oh. There's a traitor. Somebody. One of us. Out there. He or she or they have been taking things. Camera. Who used the camera? For real. Who? What do you got? Yes, for real. And I don't have shit. I just know. Lily. It counts off and it's the good stuff. Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. I see the count and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I know what happens if I start Oxy. a this hunt. So you want me to start one? I want you to poke around. What's there to go on? I found this tossed into the garbage. Huh. We don't toss out equipment, we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you were using it when you shouldn't. True. Okay. I'll poke around a little bit. Thank you. We used to have a camera. We could just use the camera and record it. A mystery. A uh, duck. Jesus, duck. I'm sorry. Um, I heard you guys talking. You need to unhear all of that. Can I help? Shh. What did I just say? You're the Grace Detective, and I can be Dick Grayson, your ward. That's Robin. I know who it is. Fine. You can help. Don't tell anybody. Yeah, the gonna snitch. Yeah, good. What do I do? I, I don't know. Go look around. Let me know if you find anything weird. I'm on the case. He's gonna fuck it up. Weird. That will help punch it. What was that? Go upstairs? Talk to Lily yet? Yeah. She thinks supplies have been walking away. Dude. Really? Don't some tell her. Equipment too. I'll look into it. Thanks for doing that. It's her. What I wanted to say was, I've been thinking a lot about you. M me too. I think about you too. Our group is small. You're small. I'm big. You're a convicted killer. Carly, Jesus. And I think people should know. Not because they deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. I got cucked. People need to know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have to tell everyone, but think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. Nope. Forget it. I have. You should, too. Larry's gone, but he knew. If he didn't tell Lily outright, he probably said enough to make her wonder. I'll tell you what I would tell anybody, apocalypse or not. There comes a time when you can get out ahead of something like this and discuss it on your terms. Do it before that chance is taken away. No. Cr uh... no. no. I'm not doing that. 
People have enough to worry about. What are you so afraid of? Three months ago I told you to tell no one and now I'm telling you to tell everyone. Do you think it's because they'll turn on you? We almost got eaten for fuck's sake. Things are different now. I hope you change your mind. I said no, you um, fucking bimbo. Is there anything else you want to talk about? Do you know anything about this flashlight? It's broken. I know it's broken. And the batteries <sighs> might be in backwards. It uses just one. Everything should. What was the question? Did you break the flashlight? No. Okay. It's her. You, uh, have any thoughts about Lily? I worry about her. That's about it. She keeps trying to run things, but it's just not working. Do you feel safe here? Show me a bath with a heated floor and a high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied Malbec and then I'll feel safe. I don't know, this place is fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. You really think people are ready to hear about me? It's not a matter of ready or not. There's never going to be a good time, but there are going to be a lot of bad ones. Right now doesn't seem like one of them. But everyone's different. Who knows how each person would take it, you know? Maybe it's worth thinking about who you want to tell. I'm gonna look into this thing. Good idea. I'm not gonna do it. Maybe she knows. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. You didn't accidentally break a flashlight, did you? No. Did Duck say I did? No. Did uh, Duck break the flashlight? I don't think so. He's just always blaming me for stuff. Like what? Putting a bug on his pillow. Did you do that? Yes. <laughs> I'm sure. If you're getting blamed, you did it. What's wrong? Dude, we shouldn't tell everybody about it. I think that's stupid. Why would we tell everybody about the flashlight? It means that we kn they're going to know where else to Do you guys know anything about this broken flashlight? Fuck. We don't got many of those. Yeah, it's a problem. The glass and the bulb are all busted out. I saw some broken glass over by the ice machine. I meant to clean it up before the kids hurt themselves on it. I forgot, though. I'm gonna go. Let's investigate, boys. No stones will be left unturned. My dude. Fits like a puzzle. What the fuck is this? Taste it. Chalk. Pink. Hmm. Dark. A clue. Maybe. What do you think it is? I don't think it's anything. Maybe it's a sign. It could be. It's pink chalk, which is weird. Okay, back to investigating. Oh, they're marking the the. They're marking the houses to hit for the bandits. Sounds like Kenny actually has that thing running. I'll believe it when I see it. They're saying, hit this place and shit like that. So the bandits know where the supplies are or what place to, to hit first. Chalk around? Ah, yes. Clementine loves to draw with it. Yeah, of course. I'll talk to her. Is it her, you little bitch? Ungrateful? Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. Do uh, you have any pink chalk? No. It's gone somewhere. Hmm. Do you want blue? No, no, it's okay. Psst, Lee. What's up, motherfucker? I found something. What is it? I found this piece of pink chalk and a scuff of it over by the gate. Really? Totally. I was calling the scene for clues Yeah, and... Duck, I got it. Good job. It's him. Mm. 
everybody was over here, too. See? I did good, huh? Yeah, Duck. You did. I suppose I should go out there and look around. You stay here this time. Seriously. Okay. He's not gonna stay here, dude. What was the flashlight? You didn't break the flashlight, did you, Duck? No. Mom and Dad won't let me touch any of their stuff. Lily neither. That's probably for the best. I don't buy it. Things are too convenient. Oh, what is this shit? Those bandits gave us hell, but they've been quiet for days now. They're preparing. The fuck is this? <clears throat> They're hiding supplies. The oxy and the op the opioids or whatever. You haven't come up with anything, have you? I came up with this. It's got a bunch of meds in it. It was in a grate on the outside wall. And there's a sign on the other one. Holy fuck. Yeah. Okay, we line everybody up. Everybody. Somebody is killing us. Stealing from that supply is the same as slipping into your room at night and cutting your throat while you sleep. You die. What is the difference? What if Clementine gets sick and we don't have what we need? What the hell? Uh, it's too late to steal from us. Who the fuck is that? Yo, man, got our people out there. Out we ain't fucking around. What do we do? Oh, Lily. shit. They're gonna start kicking in doors any second. Lily, what the hell are you? Stall them. What? Just keep them talking. Do whatever it takes to stop him pulling the trigger. Oh God. The biggest mistake of your life. Isn't she like a cowgirl? She knows how to shoot. Enough of this bullshit. Drew, stop putting your boot to these doors. Yeah. Hold it, asshole. Take it easy. We have more supplies. We can keep the deal going. Too Good. late, shithead. We ain't giving second chances. What do you mean? It, it was a mix-up. We'll make it worth your while. I'm listening. Uh. What will it take to reach a deal? About twice as much as you've been giving us. You got it. Done. Is that so? Yeah. Well, I suppose we ought to hash out some terms then. I don't like no hash. Man, shut up, bro. Christ! Oh shit! Headshot! Uh, out of juice! Whoa! Shut the butt cheek! Boy, there's more of them. Get back there! Smoke him out! Shit! We gotta get out of here! No shit! Get those bastards! Cover our people and get them to the RV! Okay. Shroud time, boys. Easy! Go around shit the range is back there! Now! Get over here! Hurry! We have to save our asses! Get inside! And they aim! Help! Gotcha! Hang on! Oh my god, dude! Where is he? Damas! One tap. Double kill. Ace. Gotcha. Hurry, come on. Clint, get inside the RV. It's gonna be okay. Go. Oh Christ. Is he bitten? Lily, get in the RV. Annoying Four. sucker. What? No! Of course not! Shit! 
sharpshooter. Are you okay? Do we leave it behind her? I'm fine. Oh, shit. Oh, she's here. Shit. Oh, sh I'm sorry. Everything's fine. Everything's ben. not fine. We need to figure out how this happened. We just lost everything. Well, we're lucky as shit to have this RV. And nobody died. Cat's head is split I'm open. I'm fine. Somebody in here caused this. Settle down back there. The bandits have had our number Kenny. of weeks. This is different. Somebody was working with them. Whoever it was was slipping them our meds. They didn't get their last package, so they attacked. No, that's the girl. Lily. There. That's nuts. Lee found a bag of supplies hidden outside the wall. It's true. So, Carly, is there something you want to say? I think it's Carly. Please, we have to get it out of you then. Back off. You are in no position to make demands. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're just pointing fingers. I didn't just come up with this. I've had my suspicions. Maybe it was. Lee, her. come on. I don't have anything to hide. Are you saying someone does? Yes. Nice bait. I said maybe it was you. Like, look, maybe we should uh, vote or something like that. Vote? What? Just look. Carly's a stand up gal, and maybe this was all just a mistake. We need to look at the facts. Let's calm down. We'll eat and we'll deal with it. Yeah. Let's now. do that. Guys, we have to act now. I know it sounds nuts, but we have a traitor here. Do you guys get that? Someone who puts their insidious shit above everyone else. Thank you, Lee. Nobody was stealing anything. Ben. Was it both of you? What? I've seen you two together. Was it both of you? Look, just let me out. I didn't do it, but I don't like this. I don't like where it's headed. Look me in the eyes and tell me you didn't have anything to do with it. Lily, lay off of him. I... Shit. What's going on up there? I hit something. We gotta stop. The engine's gonna fuck up. We can deal with this now, then. Ben, bitch. I give him some crackers, yo. Kenny, is it safe? Should be. Everybody out. Lily. Out. Kenny, the RV has some surface damage, but there's a walker trapped underneath. God damn it. Everyone, keep your eyes peeled. Peeling my eyes. You know what? We shouldn't just kick you out. We should hear what everybody thinks. I think you should chill out. I'm not gonna take this. You can push Ben around, but you can't push me around. I'm really sorry. Starting to think maybe it was. Bullshit. I don't know, chat. I don't know. I'm not gonna read chat. Dumb fuck walker. Mods, Ben is spoiler. And he's and he's yeah, chat. Son of a bitch. Ben, you have no other options. Leave him alone. You can tell me it was Carly, and then everything will be right. It's not Carly. Right. There's no way it was Carly. It's Carly. It was somebody else. It could have even been someone sneaking into our camp. That's ridiculous. That's what you think? Yes. Okay, fine then. Kenny. I don't know. Fuck. Just. Stop, would you? Well, your vote counts for you and Katja. We don't need all these votes. What do I have to do for you to trust me? I'll do anything. I'll I'll do watches for months. Huh, the hell you will. I'll get more food, more medicine, anything. You're Chill. making it worse on yourself. I just don't want to be on my own. You just should have thought of that. Do we need any more evidence than this? Fuck evidence. Stop treating him like this. Shut up, Carly. Ugh, I've heard enough out of you. Kenny, what's it gonna be? Just give me a damn minute. What if it's her, but she's instigating it? You have until that walker is dealt with to tell me it was her and not you. Stop this, you're torturing him. No! Ben! Stop! This is about trust, and I've never trusted you. Tell her. Tell her. Just do it, Ben. Wait, Jesus, well, who are you right tell now? Tell her what? She'll kick me out of the group. We won't. We'll understand. Tell me. Now. 
I got him. Please, let's just get back That's in the army. That's not happening. You think you're some tough bitch, don't you? Like nothing can hurt you. But you're just a scared little girl. Get the fuck over it. Take a page from Lee's book and try helping somebody for once. Now, what the fuck's the problem? No! My date! It was her. Ah, <sighs> okay, well. Keep duck away from the windows. Jesus Christ. Get it. It's Clem. This crazy bitch. It's Clementine. She couldn't be trusted, Lee. I swear. Please. We need manpower. What are we gonna do with her? Just get in. I'm gonna tie her up. Figure out what to do with you. It's a bad idea, Lee. She's a murderer for shit's sake. I'm a murderer? You've had Lee with you this whole time. What are you talking about? He didn't tell you. He killed someone before all of this. He was a convicted murderer. Is that true, Lee? Yes. Fucking hell. Were you Switching. ever going to get around to telling me that? You got a little girl with you. To hell with it. I don't have anything I don't want to hear left. it from either of you. Just get in. Lily is such a cow, dude. So how do we know it was actually her? Lee, a word please? Nope. It was Clementine for sure. What's up? Is Doug feeling all right? Ben. Oh, fuck. Happened during the raid. He's gonna turn. We don't know that. Gotcha. What do we really know? None of us have been bitten. We don't know what the time frame is for a child. We know nothing. I'm going to monitor him and focus on the wound and see if his condition changes. We keep the same plan unless something changes. East. Guys. What else is there to do? We thought you should know. Not that you've ever afforded us that type of luxury. Anyway, if you could tell Clementine, we would appreciate it. You know, it sounds weird, but the, the best way to do it would be to go to like to, go to like to one of those sex shops and get one of those like balls or whatever, right? And just put them in their mouth so they can't bite you. Then they're useless. Then you can hang out with zombies all you want. They can't they can't bite you for shit because they got the ball in their mouth, right? Can you move them? That's you know. Duck is bitten. Huh? He got bit by a walker trying to escape the motel. I don't feel good. Oh no. What about Carly? Gone, but won't come back. So she sorry. was shot in the head. That's right. By a cow. It's horrible. Yeah, it is. Badman. I'm glad I have you. Oh, that's sweet. Me too. I heard you outside my treehouse that day and thought about dropping a hammer on your head. Uh, that's nice. I didn't, though. Thanks.
This is so tense. The nano. What the fuck? What happened? This is not real. Get off of me. <laughs> fuck, dude. Fucking dreamer. Debated. Damn it. Roads blocked. Go to the woods. Off road. Now we gotta deal with this. Just get a tape measure and measure between between the trees on where the truck can go and make a path after measuring everything. Is there any way to get around it? Doesn't look like it. On foot, maybe. Can't really afford to do that now. This seems like a safe area. All this brush will stop anything from creeping up on us. And I'd like everyone out of the RV except her. I don't want folks trapped in there with me. Why don't you and I go look around? Yeah, everyone else relax. Clint, stay close to Kenny and Cat, okay? Lee, if you come across anything to drink, uh, if there's a dining car or something, I think Duck's a bit dehydrated. It's a freighter, hon. Be careful in there. What? You think there might be something dangerous inside an abandoned locomotive? Hadn't crossed my mind. Smart ass. Ben, what's up? Was it you? Was it you? Not this again. Was it? No! Okay then. You, uh, happy you stayed with us all this time? Yeah. Really? It's with you guys or dead. I would have died out there in the woods. Just like my classmates. You think this is better? Yeah, of course. What would you have done with Lily? I don't know. Left her? I've never seen anybody kill someone like that before. Yeah, you've seen a bunch of other stuff by now. Yeah, but not like that. Dumb bimbo. That's one hell of a mess. Zombies inside for sure. Music. Whoa. Somebody's been living in here. Yeah, man. Shit. Think they're gone? I hope so. But this looks recently used. Be on the lookout and have your guard up. Looks unopened. Yo, free water. I'll take this to catch up for Doug. Under a map of where the train goes, I think these tracks might lead to the coast. Route 27, Savannah. Savannah. That's where Kenny's got us headed. That's East Coast, motherfucker. New York. Here it comes. Let's try this one. Oh, it's the engine. Maybe we can repair it. He says no. Tools. Go with this. This looks like it's gonna be like the most efficient because it's highlighted. No! 
Well, I'll take all of it. One trick Andy. Any compartment to move, we can fix it. Oh. Nothing. Nothing, huh? What this? Inside it. Shit. Fuck. We got hey. one. Walker, sit Jesus. in the chair. We got him. Wrench him. <laughs> Not good enough. Yeah. Look him over. yeah. That's not good enough. I don't think this guy came back. Christ. That light is blinking. Push it. Push it? Why not? Are you fucking serious? <laughs> Here, look. It's just the brakes. Okay, I'll give you that one. This fucker works? Seems like it. I'll be damned. How the hell do we get it moving? I don't know. That's Mr. Amtrak over here. No clue. We found this in the boxcar back there. Whoa, is this what it looks like? I think so. This hoss will take us right to Savannah. A hundred tons of steel. Put a thousand walkers between us and the ocean, and we don't have to give a shit. I can't believe it. We just have to figure out how to get it started. Just have to figure out how to get it started. Is it blowing? Sure figure it out. How tough could it be? No idea, but we'll find out. That's the spirit. Man, if you could keep an eye on the girls and duck, I'd appreciate it. I'm gonna make sense of these controls. Man, this could be exactly what we need. What was that pamphlet? A bunch of papers. Pick them up. A bunch of maps about Georgia's cities. Nothing about the train. What is that? Yo. Was hey, that Lily? What's up? I hope it's all right I chose to keep Lily with us. Abandoning someone on the side of the road is the same as murder. Turning over a new leaf, huh? I'm just doing what I can. It's fine for now, but we have to deal with it eventually. God, we need some help getting this train going. People take notes, right, when we're working on stuff like this? Uh, we're smart guys, we can figure it out. Yeah, I'm smart, yeah. God, we need some help Oops. getting this train going. People take notes, right, when we're working on stuff like this? We're smart guys. We can figure it out. You want to talk about Doug? I'm really sorry, Kenny. Nobody deserves this. There's nothing to talk about. You heard Cat. He could be fine. We probably shouldn't ignore him. Nobody's ignoring nothing. I'm not worried. You shouldn't be either. So he one-tapped the person that was with us. I'll get back to it. With the brick get last time. When, when it's this kid, it's different. Hypocrite Andy. No, wrong spot. I have no idea what to do with these. Well, I know what to do. It. 
Hold up. What, what, what if he fired up now? Try again? Nothing. Damn. Yeah, I think I might be out of juice. Water. Here, found some water. Oh, thank you. Perfect. He's allergic to bees. Is that right? It's all I can keep thinking about. Like, somehow that matters. It doesn't. I know. Bees. Well, I don't. But you're probably right. Look, I got no idea how to get the engine started. That guy in the cab probably knew. Yeah, well, he isn't talking. Well, he had to learn it somewhere. True. Hey, Clem. What are you going to do with Lily? Kill her. Punish her somehow. She did a terrible thing. She killed her. Yeah, it, it's horrible. Okay. I'll take one for the team, all right? I will, I will take it by myself to punish myself. I'll just do it, dude. Somebody has to do it, right? We, we, we missed something, chat. We just missed something. Right there. Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn, pages are gone. I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. Find a way to read the notepad. Ooh. The fuck? Nothing about the train. Hey, kid. What's up? All right, then. Yep. The fuck's going on? A new tool, maybe? Spike remover. inside there. Maybe he dropped the letter there. We can find it. I think that's the wrong side. It is. I can get it over there. Up this side. Ah, there it is. Uh, it's stuck. I can definitely pry this thing free if I can break it loose first. Derailed. I can break it loose first. Shit. Broken. The spider mover. Oh, maybe she can read because she's in first grade. Let's ask Clem if she can read it. There's a notepad on the train. Do you have any pencils or anything in your pack? No, I wish. Maybe in the RV. What do you need it for? There used to be something written on the notepad that I need to know about. Oh, well, 
if you don't end up using it, I'd take it. I like to put leaves between the pages and color over them. Like make a rubbing. Yeah, it's fun. I rem I never thought of this. You understand it? Slowly brush the the pencil across the paper and it'll show the indentation Hey Lily Lily I'm sitting here tied up like an animal while you guys decide what to do with me It's not like that Then what's it like Interesting. So where's the pencil, dude? Right there, found it. Crayon. I'm leaving. Go. Now! Come with me. We could take the RV right now. He left the keys in it. So I'm fault. No way. Didn't think you would say yes. I can't let you take the RV. It will be crazy. You're not letting me take it. Sorry, Lee. I really am. <laughs> What? Holy shit. She's stealing the RV. Lily! Come back here, you crazy bitch! Fuck! Stop! Fucking bimbo. There's only four of us left out of the eight initially, dude. That's crazy. Let's focus on the train. Well, we're fucked if we don't figure out how this thing works. Can't spend the night out here. Old witch. Duck is still sick, you know. We need to get to the city, the coast. East coast. Move, man. Guys, I thought about it thoroughly. It is literally the best way to do it. A rating system and survival is the best way to do it. Everybody has a skill, whether it's gathering, killing, getting food, hunting, cooking, and each has its own value. And if people are not high rated enough, you just kill them. Perfect. You can rate it now? Yeah, should be able to just follow the steps to get the engine on. Sounds good. Six, down, down, up, up. Up, down, up. Five, mid, up. Nine, left, nine, right. Down, down, up, 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 down, up. Here we go. Down, down, up. Up, up, down, up. Son of a bitch! Whatever you did, lit the dash up. Yeah, I'm so smart. Far, so good. Let me do my thing. No. Miss Lick. You. Now we're talking. No, no, don't. Idiot. Get your ass back in there, bitch.
left and right. Outside. Bang it. Now it's left then right. Good job, buddy. You're almost there. Hey! We started. Holy shit. We're golden. Yeah, we are. Golden. Feels good. Let's fucking enjoy this. Mom, let's see if she'll move. No. What about the derailment? What, what have you seen before? It's all yours. Not gonna work. I'm pretty sure we have to do it before them. Attached. Can you go find out where we're stuck? Get us unstuck? Yeah. The spike remover is probably the tool we have to use here, boys. Spanner too, and we take one of them. Let's go fix that bitch up. Yeah, this is some park action, boys. Easy. Hey, Kenny, we're loose. You guys, you touch any of my stuff? Who are you? The guy who owns that stuff. I guess it's no worse for wear. Name's Chuck. Charles, if you fancy. Lee. That your crew outside? Yeah. And the guy up in the cab? Him too. I saw you walking through here and thought about scaring the pants off you. What? That's funny. But I couldn't force myself to do it. You're still kind of freaking me out. Train folk will do that. Already met everyone outside. They all warmed to me right quick in direct sunlight. Horus and after Twitch? Question mark? You met Chuck? Yeah, I did. It's so nice to meet someone normal for a change. He gave us candy, Ben too. What's your game, man? Keep him alive. That's not bad. I Smart. like it. You met Kenny? Sure did. Man shares my love of the road. That's for certain. <coughs> He's dead. I'm awful sorry your son's not feeling good. I appreciate your concern. Well, with a little TLC, I'm sure he'll be fit as a fiddle in no time. And I can offer y'all whatever I got. Although it ain't much. Thank you. 
We'd like to do the same. Why don't we hold off on... Uh... Stay with us. We'd like the company. Oh, uh, no, sir. Hey, Chuck. Howdy. Why are you alone? Why not? Seem to be doing all right. Fine, then. I'm sorry. I do like being around y'all, actually. It's nice. You caught us on a bad day. Mm. You still got a couple of kids. And this one's got a good spirit. That's some kind of something. I'll talk to you later. Hope so. Well, I feel in time. That candy Chuck gave you. It tastes okay? It was really good. Poison. No funny aftertaste? No. Train's cool, huh? I guess. It's scary, kind of. Yes, I think Todd said anything to you about Connie or Duck or anything. I'm worried about her. No. That little girl is a puzzle. Yeah, she is. Poor Carly. God, where did yesterday go? I don't know. Are you okay? I know you were fond of her. I'm fine. fine. Don't worry about it. I do. Don't. I like her, but she's gone now. I'm sorry, Lee. I'm sorry about the RV. I'm worried. We're really on our own out here now. Well, we're putting some time into this train. Worst comes to worst. Boxcar safe enough to sleep in. Housed up. Dead. Tired, which could mean a lot of things, right? Yeah, his body's probably fighting whatever's in it. Exactly. Anyway, let me know if anything changes here. Well, what about this guy? How you doing, Ben? I'm watching the girls and not working on a mega cool train. What do you think? Fuck you, pussy bitch. So that's it? We're cut loose? Seems that way, yeah. Great. We don't got much left, so just gather whatever you have. Let's go. Want to ride? Well, it sounds like you're taking my home. That's a yes, then. And find anything better for keeping the creepy crawlies out than that boxcar. The creepy crawlies. Duck's sick. Get on the train, Clementine. Getting sicker. Let me look at him. Mm. We can keep going if you want. Damn right I won't. That's what we're doing. I think Lee just wants to talk it through. It's talked through. Get on, Kent. I'll be up front. I don't want to hear any nonsense until we get where we're going. Kenny turned into such a bitch, dude. Seriously. He was fighting the whole game. Now he's just some, some cuck. Let's boot it up. Pop it! This one's dying? I don't give a fuck.
He's gonna turn. Gotta be hard on you, eh? Three adults taking care of three kids. No disrespect, son. <laughs> There's not. He's not gonna shoot the whole squad. We'll be fine. We've gone through just as much as anybody else. This one's gonna grow up quick. I already am. I don't doubt it, son. Lee. Please, I need you right now. I need you. Oh no. What's up? If you get that off his face, my hands are full here. Thank you. Could you just get that off his face, please? Wait, to wipe him? What, what does it look like? A janitor? He's out of time. We need to stop this train. No. Okay. What if the train stops and doesn't doesn't start again and we all die? Throwing him off sounds like the best option. Kenny's never gonna know. We just tell him that he fell off. A Stop the train. Kenny, what? Ken, what your the son. Is that? His son's blood. Get out of here, Lee. You know he's dying. Nobody knows shit. He'll be fine. Fuck up, man. This is over. He's dead. Don't you tell me to wake up. I got a real family I'm trying to protect. Not that fucking sham you're running back there. Wrench him? Fuck. I don't give a fuck. That's what I figured. What is the goddamn deal? He's a little sick, but we can't just quit. It's a scratch. He's not like the others. Jesus, all y'all are just making it worse. This isn't about Doc. It's not about my son dying. What the hell do you know? You're not my friend. I don't hate you. You sure as shit haven't done anything for me. What? How many sons are you gonna let die? Shut your mouth! I wanna fight, motherfucker! Uh, just leave uh, me the fuck alone! Uh, I don't need you, and Doc doesn't need you! Stop it, man! We're gonna break it. I told Kaja I'd get you to stop this, and you bet your ass I'm gonna. No, sir. No, sir. Don't give a fuck that we don't get along. I'm not letting you do this to Cat and Duck. You want to hurt people because you're afraid. Losing Duck ain't enough for you. Because you're fucking lose everything acting like this. I'll fucking kill you before I let that happen. Sorry, man. I'm sorry. I knocked some sense into him. Damn right, I did. That's so dumb, dude. How is stopping the train gonna help anybody? Are we gonna find medicine out there? It's... I think it's time.
The boy's been bit, in case you haven't figured that out. Oh, we shouldn't waste time. There ain't none left to waste. I'm saying we shouldn't stay put. What are we going to do? Kill him. We can't allow him to become one of those things. But what if, what if he doesn't? Kenny, I love you very much. I love our son more than life itself. I need you to hear me. What you are saying, that he may not turn, is foolish. But... No. There's... Come on, Kat. If you think of one, you let me know. Isn't there some sort of pill or something we can just give him? Stop it. Just drift off to sleep. Right, hon? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know. But we know it's here or nothing. Oh, fuck. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do it. No, you don't have to. God, you fuck. I, I, I can. I can do this. I got it. Do it. No. It should be a parent. No parent should have to do something like this. He's right, Cat. True. We can say our goodbyes and just let that be it. I don't know. Lee, you'd be doing this family a great service. Why don't we take him into the forest so Clementine doesn't have to see? Yeah. Give us a moment to say goodbye. Of course. Just close the door and go. This is about to turn to shit, boys. You're in a moving train going to freedom. And you choose to go into the forest with a child to go kill him. Instead of just throwing him off. That's crazy. Nothing. Everything is fine. No, it's not. What are you doing? I'm putting him out of his misery. Oh. Sorry. Yeah. Look, Clem. Things are... What the... No! Ben, take Clementine into the train. Go. It'll be fine. She got bit. The cow got bit. She killed herself. Cat, cat, gotcha. Why, cat? Honey, oh fucking god. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Move on. Still have to deal with Duck. It's not going to do it. I don't think they can show that in the game. Give me the gun, kid. I'll do it. Let's cap him, boys. Goodbye, duck. See, they can't show it. Told you guys. They're not allowed. Later.
We had to squish him like a cockroach, chat. Fast as fuck! One day one. Stupid motherfucker. Hey, how you doing? I don't care what reason you had for doing it. No reason to go and tell my girl she's gonna end up dead. Cause she is. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow that y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna. What do you know? I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? Then I kill your crusty ass piece of shit. I figure it out. Well, get to figuring, because it'll be on top of us before you know it. Look, sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. If it were... You gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. A lot of Bob. Barber. It ain't gotta be styled, Jesus. You gotta run around with a mop that's gonna act like Velcro to any hand swinging its way. Find some scissors in my pack, and take care of that hair before Walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. Okay. Explain True. to her how they work, and not to be afraid. I don't mean to tell you how to do your job. But too many people have died already. They have. And seeing another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. A plan, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. Shot the kid, you know. I suppose someone had to. What a mess. You said it. You have any family? Out there, somewhere. Been sort of on my own for the past oh, 14 years now. Damn! Sorry to hear that. No one to blame. You're homeless. <laughs> eh, suppose. I've had homes <sighs> here and there and. And they just don't work out. Hey, you can't pay rent. I like a drink, you know? Yeah. You got any? No. Darn. It's your Where house. Are you uh, that way. I mean, when we get to Savannah. You got a few ideas. We'll have a talk when we get there about whether or not you folks want company. Be safe up here. You betcha. Head back inside. I don't know how to talk to him. Fuck him. What's going on with Ben? Hey, Ben. Hey. Aren't many of us left. Yeah. You, me, and Kenny. Clementine. The homeless dude if he sticks around. Are you going to be able to step up? I can do just as much as anyone else. Good. I hope that's true. Carly didn't have to die, you know. She would have killed me instead. Yeah, maybe. True. See you. Oh, well, voice acting lag. The door to the boxcar. Damn right. See ya. 
Clementine. Oh, no. Hey, Clint. Did you talk to him? I did. He had some, uh... He explained himself and made some good points. Look, we're not gonna let anything bad happen to you. But there are some precautions we have to take. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay. What should we do? Well, we're gonna figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and, uh, tidy up a little. So you can't get grabbed so easily. I'd like that. Good. I thought we shave it all off, though. You need to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got it. I mean, with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And uh -oh. don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Oh, uh, hell no. Okay. See? It's not scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. To aim, you look right down the top, through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is there anything else I should know? When you're ready to shoot, make sure you're not breathing too hard. And then hold your breath, right when you pull the trigger. Like when I'm swimming? No, just for a quick second. I found that if I did that, I was a lot more accurate. It's tough, but it'll help. I can do that. Okay. I'm dead. Good. Don't lock your elbows. Okay, let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly, and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. Trash. Okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have to? Yeah. When's the name, dude? Him right. Bit to the right. Okay, a little higher. To the right! Aim more to the right. Close. Now keep it steady. Are you high? Okay, aim a little bit more to the left. Aim lower. Clapped. I got it. Excellent. Good shot. Again. It was left. A bit more to the left. And lower. A little bit lower. Left. Right. A little bit more to the left. Steady? Steady now. Almost got it. To the right. To the right. And up. Aim a little higher. Easy! There you go. Nice. Sharp shooter achievement, boys. Again. Clap. I did it! Yeah, you did. Woo! Good job. I was holding my breath, and the gun didn't shake so much. See, you did good. They're not walkers, though. No, far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay, I feel good. Not so scary, huh? Nuh-uh. Thanks, Walking Dead. No, I know. The children can use a gun easily. They can shoot steadily. Smiley face. They look clean enough. All right. How about some cornrows? Hey, Clint. So they won't be all, you know. So you're probably not gonna like this. Oh no! What happened? Nothing. We have to talk about your hair. 
It's not safe. That's not nice. What? Are you saying it smells? No. Because it does. Kinda. Do you remember when Andy St. John grabbed it and I got mad? Yeah. Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? I need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. <sighs> okay. That's why cornrows are good. Nah, cut that shit. We do this now. I guess not. Don't mow. It's a good thing. Do what? you know how to do this? Of course. I'm a barber. Yeah, of course. I don't believe you. Well, good. Good? Means you know when someone's lying to you, which is another valuable survival <laughs> skill. So you did kill someone before? Yeah. You could have just told me. I wouldn't have been afraid of you or anything. I'm sorry. You've killed lots of things now. It doesn't even matter. What does now she's right before all of this I was sent to jail you know did people ever go to jail when they shouldn't all the time okay I think I'm about done I can probably tear these pieces back with some here I have some hair thingies you do uh, some yeah. thingies Lily gave them to me for sleeping there all set Cap. Does it look dumb? <laughs> no, you look cute and a lot harder to grab. You look stupid. Okay, why don't you just fix the camera so we can see progress bar? Oh, uh, let's try here this time. Does oh it no! Look dumb? <laughs> no, you look cute and a lot harder to grab. She's sad. Get the fuck in. Let's go to Havana or Savannah. Pussy. What does he want? Hey. hey, it'll be good to get to the water. Are there any maps up here? I don't. I just uh, want to look over one with Clem so she has a lay of the land once we get to Savannah. That's it right here. I can see it. Mind if I get by you for a second, Kitty? Can you just leave me alone? What a stupid fuck! You mind if I look in there for a second? I really wish you'd just leave me alone. Are you serious now? Hey. Yeah. Still want to get a vote? It's still the best plan. Yeah. It's the best plan. I wanted to talk to you about keeping my past from you all. Doesn't matter a lick to me. Fuck. Just gotta move forward. Uh, okay. It's full of maps and documents. Is it still matter? Get out of here. I'm about to knock this fucker out, dude. I'm about to break his sit on the fucking wheel, dude. Hey, Ben. Hey. See you. I already did that earlier. Yeah. Sorry, boy. Now we should give him the juice. The whiskey. Get on drunk. 
That's the way to do it. Easy date. Should have known. Are there any maps up here? I don't know. I just uh, want to look over one with Clem so she has a lay of the land once we get to Savannah. What's your problem? Are you serious? For a second, Kenny. Can you just leave me alone? You mind if I look in there for a second? I really wish you'd just leave me alone. Okay, let's give the, the alcohol to the to the Chucky. Well, I don't remember where is that though. Sorry about your hair. I think it looks cute though. My mom isn't going to like it. What do you think about Chuck? I don't know. Me neither. He might be an okay guy though. You think? We'll keep an open mind about him. He's probably had it pretty rough. I need to look around for a few things that'll make sure we're prepared when we get to Savannah. That would be good. I hope it's safe there. God, me too. Okay. So how do I get to him? Oh, to the side. When I get a beer sometime? Uh, not really. I don't really go out. Oh, Chuck is in front. I forgot about that. Give him the juice, man. If you want it. Damn. Didn't realize I had it left. Thank you. Want a nip? Well, hell yeah, I do. What the fuck? Sure. Why aren't we sharing with the others? Not known for its finish. No kid. Maybe Clem. Mm. Anybody in there want to share a drink? You let them know. Will do. Well, the girl can shoot. It doesn't have to be pretty. Probably will be before too long. Be safe up here. You betcha. What's up, Kenny? How about you in the map now, bitch? Chuck wanted to know if you needed a drink. He's got some? Yeah. Ah! That'd help. That's what I thought. Get your ass back there. Yoink! Stolen. Let's go shorter than that. It was me. Huh? Say that again? I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? I fucking knew I did. It's all my fault. What for? Why the hell would you do this? They said they had my friend, that he was with them. By the time I realized they didn't, it was too late. They said they'd kill me, kill all of us. Okay, well, you die now. Nah, you kill still him. You wanna talk to me? Yep. Yeah, I do. I'm real sorry. 
Let's drop it for now, okay? See you. Yeah. If you didn't do it, Kai would still be alive, dude. It's all his fault. gonna do when we get there. We don't know what to expect. The city could be bad or totally under control. The thing is, you and I, we're a team, you know? And a team needs a plan. Aside from everyone else, when this train stops, you and I should know exactly what we're doing. And how about a drink? A plan. I like it. <laughs> Good. I think we should look for your parents. Really? Yeah, you need to know if they're okay. Well, if they're not, what happened to them? I'm sure they're okay. Yeah, it's best to stay positive. That's what Dad always says. Let's look That's at the map. Cute. If we can figure out where they were, we can start there. Looks like we'll come right through town if there's nothing on the tracks to hold us up. Now we've got a good chunk of Savannah here. What do you think? They always stay in the same place when they go there. It's, uh... Hmm. Hey, don't worry. We'll figure it out. Have you ever been there? Once. Well, think about it. There are a lot of hotels on here, but read this map and maybe it'll jog your memory. They've got really tasty desserts. It's called the... M... M... something... Mar. Is this it? The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! So we'll head there. That's yes. it! You think we have a good plan? I think it's very good. Can I tell my parents? You know. Tell her what? No. Clem, come on. That's not a good idea. You can't tell me what to do. Clementine. I don't want to talk about it anymore. All right. How do you feel? Good. Better. I'm glad we have a plan. And you're a good little chef. Thanks. I guess we should see how far- Oh shit! Hold on everybody! Oh no! The fuck my ears, dude! Unexpected delay. Dude, that's bad news. Fuck, 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 fuck! We should have ran the full speed. Walk? That's fucking stupid, Ben. I'm just saying. Hmm, I don't know. I ain't got much experience with y'all's fortitude, but we could probably deal with that. We got a goddamn train. That thing's not full of milk, Charles. That's gas or diesel. Something that's gonna explode. You gotta get a hold of yourself. This a crew here. This ain't shit. This. Yo, if you keep screaming like that, and you're gonna get your face chewed off. Hey! It's gonna be trouble because we could have just kept walking. No, we're friendly. Put your hand down, kid. That's what everybody says. We know. Let's give these guys a break. We'll see. You guys got a problem with your train? Yeah, you're standing right in front of it. Dude, it's a wreck. It's not so bad from up here. Send your buddy up to have a look. Anything goes sideways up there, we won't let them escape. Damn right. Oh God, here it goes. If I come up there, you better not be murderers or thieves. I guess you'll have to find out. I mean, war or murder, so... A group of guys is what we need. They're what you think we need. We're doing fine. For now? What about when... Stop it. Hey, dude. I'm Omid. Lee. Krista. What's the deal with the train? We're driving it. Oh, man. Look, 
Uh, People. You want to help us out? We could use some able bodies, and yeah, we we really need some help. What's in it? Oh shit! God damn, you guys have a kid. Yeah, three of them. What are you doing up here? Do you know how long it's been since I've seen a kid? Shit! What's your name? Clementine. Oh, so he gets to swear. Oh, this is great. See, things are looking up. You're not her dad. He down there? It's that obvious? To me. And no, he's not down there. Huh. What's your story? We've just been trying to get by together. Maybe find her parents. And everybody down there, they're cool? They're cool. Ben's young and stupid, and I think harmless. The first two things you said don't really go with the third. I know. We just have to keep an eye on him. No sweat. It's been rough for everybody down there. I'm sure you can say the same. We're sorry for anything that's happened to you guys. That train is awesome, though. A tank is your real problem. We'll help you with it. But if we see anything we don't like, we're moving on down the road. Okay. Um, we'd appreciate the help. You can't just blast through it, I guess? If you could get it down, the rest would probably be pretty easy. We'll start there. We'll come down and settle in and see if we can help. The best way to do it, if I was in that situation, dude, all you gotta do is build a ramp down below. There's no way I'm pulling anything apart down there. Make it slide it like Tony Hawk. So when you drop it, it just rolls away. Guys, this is Omid and Krista. Not big on welcomes? Like I said, we could use some good people. We just wanted to say hi and say your train is pretty cool. But we are not looking for charity. We could help you guys, though. Maybe. The plan is to cut that tanker down and be on our way. Seems like plan enough to me. You want to start in on that tanker? I'll get to know the girl for a minute, if you don't mind. And why don't I show you how this thing works? In case something happens. Don't! Really, kid, it's probably for the best. Someone might want to have a look inside of that station back there, too. Sounds great. Let's do this thing. Your music sucks, dude. All right. Got a clear view up there? Yeah, we're good for a ways. Thank God. We need someone, anyone, to come along and, and exterminate them or something. Toughen up. It's you, me, and now Chuck. Who knows what these new people have planned? There are going to be a lot more walkers to take care of. That's what I'm afraid of. I'm telling you, E. If they ever get a hold of me, and I know I'm not getting out of it, that's it, man. I'm just gonna punch my own ticket. Punch your own ticket? Yeah. Take myself out. Coward. Don't be dramatic. And don't let them get a hold of you. I'm glad someone's managed to keep the spirit. Can you move it? This would create one hell of a fireball if we tried to blast through. Fuck, dude, yeah, it's full. Let's go front. Two made it this far. You seem dangerously normal. Krista doesn't let us join groups, and I'm a fucking scrapper. I got the feeling she takes care of you. Please, I've saved her ass hundreds, tens, sometimes. Smiley face. 
Learning the ropes can't be too hard, right? There are a lot of levers I can't wait to use. I said if something were to happen to me, maybe we can drive in shifts. We'll see. How long since you've been home? Like six months. We were on the road for a while and then, you know. That's rough. Our cat is gonna be pissed. Talk to you later. His cat? That's what he's worried about? His cat? His anything? cat's dead. I'm trying to. Up. Hey there. That's a pretty useful radio for her to be holding on to, no? It's busted, but it means something to her. Oh, I understand. Not sure how we'll get that tank down. Maybe ask Omid. He likes to break things. Careful. She's a crack shot now. A crack shot? You got shot? this girl shooting guns? Look, I don't need a lecture. You weren't getting one. It's good. She should be able to take care of herself. Where are you from? San Francisco. Jeez, a long way from home. I blame the one in there. He wanted the great American road trip. Well, he got a little more than he bargained for, huh? Who the hell is into Civil War history anyway, other than old white guys? The fuck? Wonderful. You two will be thick as thieves. Fuck, that's supposed to mean. What were you two arguing about when I was coming up the ladder? Nothing. If you're gonna be around for a while, it'd be good to know what baggage you got. Then maybe we won't be around for a while. Well, get used to him, man. Oof! This is radioactive, I think. Some tape. That's about the only useful thing in here. Music stopped. It's empty. Whatever government work was going on here didn't seem to help. We're missing something, chat. There's no way I'm pulling anything apart down there. Let's get the fuck back down. Oh! That's what, I, that's what we had to do all along, huh? Can I follow you over there? No. You don't like the new girl? I do, but it's like we're a team, like you said. Yeah, all right. Come on. Clementine and I are checking out this train station, all right? Hustle over if you hear anything. Survivors inside? That's a debate. It's a bait. Somebody was doing some painting. Macab Imports. Brand Auto Parts. Let's break in. Home invasion voice. You should wait for me before trying to open doors. Sorry. Uh, luckily it's locked. We'll get better at working together. Can you just pry it open? <clears throat> mm, won't but. We can do some uh, some urban tricks. Nope. Is 
Doesn't look like that thing's worked in years. Maybe like a rock or something. We'll have to find a way in. No, we'll try that, right? Yeah, it was only locked. Look, look above. Maybe if I can look inside, I'm, I, I can break it with the wrench. Hmm. All right then. The window's open up there. We can throw Maybe in. Maybe I could look in. Yeet. Why don't I put you on my shoulders and you can peek into that window up there? Sounds good. Okay, I can see in. What do I do now? Jump, Jump in. in if you can. What about staying together? If there aren't any walkers in there, you'll be fine. It's too far to fall. Well, what do you think we should do? I think I opened it. For real? I think so. What? The fuck? Well, I'll be damned. How did you reach the bottom of it? Let's go. Be careful. I'm supposed to tell you that. Smile face. Shh. God damn, it's dark in here. Maybe I can hold the door open? I don't like that. I'll prop it open with something. That thing was in my hands instead of over there. It's too dark otherwise. I don't know what just happened. Was that a glitch? Locked up good. Maybe we can pick the lock though. That's exactly what we need. Over there? Yeah, we need to get in there and get that blowtorch. Oh, they're gonna melt it. They didn't have much business back then. I thought they were gonna ignite and let it blow up. Maybe maybe the, the explosion would have... Uh... Good. What do we need? Something to help us deal with the tanker out there. Okay. There it is. There's some space up there, but not much. We're lucky I'm so little. Yeah, we are. Uh, let's throw it in, boys. Sorry, you're gonna have to go in. You okay going over the top of this fence? Yeah, definitely. <gasps> Yeet. Go on and grab the keys, Clem. Come on, scoot. What's wrong? Behind you! Right bullets, finally. The fuck? Oh no. Oh, we're dead. She's gonna shoot me. One tap. Back up, motherfucker. Pop him. Useless Bot's okay, burger. It's okay. Everything's fine. Oh no. Jeez. Come on. God damn. That didn't go so good. No, it did not go so good. But we're okay.
okay. Everything's okay. What's going on? I thought I heard a gunshot. We're fine. We found some walkers. You and an eight-year-old versus three of them, huh? Yeah. Well, I handled it. Yeah, it looks like. What if you hadn't? I'm gonna go make sure the noise didn't cause us any problems. That's a good idea. Hey, fuck off! Dude, what a bimbo! I hope you know what you're doing with her. Me too. For her sake. I wish there was like drastic options like punching people and killing them. We got it. Let's go outside now. What did we learn? I'm not ready for a gun. No. You just have to learn to pull the trigger. It's so hard. Don't think. Just do it. Live with what happens. I'll try. Oh, let's get a move. Clementine will remember that. So next time, next time to pull the trigger. I found a blowtorch in the station. Should make quick work of the coupling up there. Excellent. I'll come up there with you to have a look. I don't trust him for shit. Leads up to that wrecked anchor. Does it? Let's try then. Is he gonna push me? Yeah, everybody knows how to handle a blowtorch, guys. If I saw one, I didn't know how to, what to do with it. Shit. What's up? The hole says a leak in it. Turn it off, dude. I, I don't want my eyebrows burned off. What? Better plug that leak with something. I got tape, yeah? Hope this holds. Let's go, come on! That's crazy. Look at it go. Just about got it. Oh shit! It's gonna pull it down. Whoa, thanks. No sweat, man. This thing is hanging by a thread. The smallest cut and it'll go. I'ma let him do it. Here, the weak portion of the coupling's out of my reach. You think it'll be within mine? <laughs> no, but I'm gonna dangle you over that ledge. The hell you are! Somebody follows him. You're a real son of a bitch, aren't you? Shut up and start cutting. Oh shit! The full squad's coming up. Guys, there's something coming. What the what? There must be thousands. We gotta go. He's gonna fall. Fuck. Oh me. Cut. Cut. I am! It's going! Pull me up! Not the ladder! Kenny, go! Shit! What the hell do we do now? We gotta jump! What? No way! Gotta do it. He's not gonna do it. Guy. Push him! It your way. I will! You son Fuck of a- Fuck it in! Peace out, mother- <laughs> Shit! Damn, that sucks!
Run! Grab her up. Uh, Omid! You son of a bitch, save him! Omid! Omid, come on, man! He had a broken leg. Help him! Guys, it's gonna give us a lot of fucky points down the line. Down the line, the, these points stack up. Fucky points. That or sucky points. Them. Are you hurt? No. We're okay. Speak for yourself. My leg is fucked. We're fine, Clementine. We're fine. I told him to jump. Oh, we actually made it there. Who is that? Is that me? That's Kenny. Oh, it's your real dad. Oh, no, I'm right. Next stop, the Atlantic. I'm stupid, sorry. It's Kenny, Cat, and. We found in Clementine's parents when we get there. Duck. I thought they were dead. Looking for them then. That's not the plan. Well, it's ours. She and I talked it through. You'll be all right. I'll be alive, I guess. Blood in my heart. Blood in my brain, at least. I'll leave you to your thoughts. She's out cold like I've never seen. Wait, it's working! What the... Maxi Mike? That fucking thing was broken. So did I. How'd they know? Who the fuck was that? If he's convinced Clementine that he has her parents, Lily you might want to rethink your plan. Lily, spill the beans. Almost at the river. You want to get on a boat? You want to wait around till the walkers figure out we're here? Do we skip? Oh, I promise that we find your pen. Guys, I can skip it so we don't so we don't see it. Yeah, okay. I'll close the um, display capture. Oh, I think I broke it. And this up audio. Okay. No, I'm not gonna look at it. I'm not looking at it. Right now it's playing. I'm gonna let it play through because this is the preview of the next episode. I don't want to spoil you guys. I'm not gonna. I'm not watching. We can see it. Oh, game capture works now. Oh, fantastic. That's bug. We can hear it. Okay, good. You guys said that I did bad choices. You guys said I was Pepega. 59, 57, 55, 79, 44. We did everything right. The whole way through. Except when we pushed off the fucking train, which is unlucky.
Alright, next episode, boys. Okay, episode, I think we're at episode number four. Around every corner. Pee break? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go pee. Everybody pee, it's right now. Go now, boys. Uh, the pee is pretty good. Okay, I'm back and I even wash my hands. I'm sure that some of you, some of you uh, feel the people already right. Already back. Wait, where's my... Yeah, I wash my hands. I'm looking for something. What the fuck, dude? Previously on The Walking Dead. Shut up, Carly. Ugh, I've heard enough out of you. Now, what the fuck's the problem? Just get in. We'll figure out what to do with you. I was trying to protect all of us. Holy shit. She's stealing the RV. I don't See, I'm know telling you guys. About you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. Y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do we do? Give me the gun, kid. I'll do it. I think we should look for your parents. Really? Yeah. You need to know if they're okay and, well, if they're not, what happened to them? I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? It's all my fault. We gotta jump! What? No way! Can you I get a go, a... please? Ah! Shit! Can't wait for you to get this We're on episode number four. I, I got your parents right here, and you be sure to find me whether Lee wants you to or not. Now, what I need... Who the fuck? I don't know. But I doubt we're going to be happy when we find out. I missed the beginning of episode 3 because of you, Pepe, Pepe you viewers. You should cater to any viewers. Dude, today was a mixed schedule. I started at like 12. It's a ghost town. Thirty thousand people? What do you mean? Oh. I just hold it. The Glock? Hell nah. Oh, the walkie talkie. Just for a little while, we're getting real close to where my mom and dad are. Maybe I can. Not now, Clementine. Maybe later, okay? Okay. How's O'Neill? His leg's pretty bad. I'm fine. You're not fine. You need to rest. He needs to rest. DMR? What is that? DMR 84B. There you no, I wish not stop. Kenny, hold up. Kenny, god damn it, I said hold up. Omid needs to take a break. Let's give him a minute. We're almost at the river. Almost to the boats. Then it won't hurt to stop for just one damn minute. What the hell? Maybe what? this city's not so dead after all. Wait, aren't bells Team automatic? Me. No one's ringing that bell. It's automatic. On a timer. What kind of church bell goes off at 20 past the hour? Oh! Someone's up there! Are you sure? I don't see anything. The bell's for intruders. I know what I saw. I'm telling you there's someone up in that bell tower. Someone alive! 
<laughs> if I were you, I'd get out of the street now. I thought you said that thing didn't work. Who the hell is this? Hello? Hello? I said answer me! Hello? What the hell was that? Is someone trying to fuck with us? Sounded more like a warning. Ask not for whom the bell tolls. What are you yammering on about? It tolls for thee. Oh, they unleashed them. Oh, the bell warned them. Run. Everybody, run! We got bug. Go. Forward! Stupid idiot! Kitty! Punch him! Whoa. Little too close, don't you think? No, man, help her! Do something, you useless fuck! Chuck is the god. Move your asses! River Street's right up ahead! That's not all. I'll give me a fucking break! Wait, where the hell's Chuck? Shit, he's in trouble. We gotta help him. There's no time. We gotta go now. I'll be time. Go! I'll get the door. He's not gonna die. Why is everybody tripping okay? and falling? Uh, yeah. You've opened up your wound. You're bleeding. Shit, it's gonna get infected. We gotta get him inside. Clean him up. Kenny, how's that door coming? I'm working on it. I'm working on it. We'll work faster, would you? Won't be long before those things outside figure out where we went. Shut the fuck up. They can smell blood. Quit it, the pair of you. Gonna bring more of them down on us. I'll see if I can find a way in. Wrench it. No way I'm gonna be able to bust through that. Wrench it. We won't be able to bust through that. How's it coming? Find a way in yet? Doors locked up tight. Too heavy to force it without making a whole lot of noise. Maybe there's a better way in. Well, if there is, I ain't seeing it. You're blind as fuck. You think maybe someone's still inside? Nah, we'd have heard from him by now, all the racket we're making. But whoever was here did a pretty good job fortifying it. Nice place to hole up. We could just figure out how to get in. I think I'll go have a look around. Is it all look? Look, look. What's this? Looks like there's some kind of pet door here. I tried it already. That's locked too. Who the hell ever heard of a locked doggy door? I have. My neighbor had one just like that. It's it's radio controlled. 
The dog wears a collar with a chip in it, so the door only opens when the dog gets close to it. That's so oh, big brainer. Every day's a school day. So inside the the, right, the, the so dog barn. Where's the dog? Dog barn. Oh, he's dead. Gotta get him out of there, boys. Looks like something was buried here. Empty. Yeah, that would have been too easy. Hold up now. Not thirsty enough to drink that yet. Why not? So there's enough to make like a shovel one was never from the useful. stuff last night, or do you want me to order a new order new ones? One. New ones? Order new ones? Or what? Order the new ones instead? Or the old ones? Are okay. Hey, be careful. I didn't hear what Digging you up dead things isn't what it used to be. You know what I mean? Want me to order new food, yeah. or do you want me to order food. make some from the one last night? Hey, Just order new food. What's up? There? What's going on there? Okay, I paused it. What's going on? Nothing. Clem, go over and sit with Krista and Omi, okay? But I want to... Just do what I say, okay? Smell. And why would they bury him with the, with a dog with a dog collar? I can't get it off. Okay, that is not cool. Jesus. Are you okay? I'm fine, honey. What a bunch of weak ass hoes did. Are you sure you? I said I'm fine. Okay. It looks like one of those, like, um, like hounds on like Diablo 3 or some shit. You know, like the hounds. Here goes nothing. Yes! God damn! She has to go through. You see anything in there? No. Looks like it's been empty a while. Whatever you're gonna do, do it fast. Okay, let me see if I can reach up in there. Be careful, man. Tomas. It's no good, I can't get it. Here, let me try. I think I can... Oh, old doggy. Clem, what do you see in there? It's just gonna open. Yeah. Good job, Clem. Yeah, way to go. I did good, right? Yes, you did. You did good. Can we maybe have this conversation inside? My leg's starting to hurt like hell. Looks okay from here. Everybody in. What? That is actual ugly wallpaper, dude. Uh, sorry, sorry. No, it's okay. I'm good. I feel better already just being off my feet. Thanks, babe. So, when were you gonna tell us about the radio? Tell you what? That it's working. That there's someone else on the other end of that thing. You didn't think that might have been worth yeah, I didn't know. the rest of us? I didn't know. I didn't know myself until it just started working out there on the street. So you don't know who that voice was? Who gives a shit about the damn radio? 
I'm more worried about whoever it was out there ringing that bell and bringing the dead down on top of us. It's like they didn't want us to make it to the river. What makes you think it's not the same person? Whoever was on the radio was close enough to see us in the street, and we didn't see anyone else other than the guy in the bell tower. Because that doesn't make a lick of damn sense. Why would they bring out the dead like that and then try to warn us about it? Damn if I know. Maybe they were just trying to mess with us. Wouldn't be the most screwed up thing I've seen these past no, three I can tell you. I don't know who it was. All I know is they're no friend of ours. Damn right. I'm telling you, they don't want us getting to the river. Maybe they want those boats all to themselves. But we'll see about that. I'm not going back out there anytime soon. Omid needs to rest. Mm. We need to make sure Chuck is okay. Once it's quieted down outside, we'll all head towards the river. See if we can find him. Deal? Shoot yourselves, you. and I'm not gonna Thank wait you. around too long for okay. someone else to grab up those boats. That's our ticket out of here. Place seems secure, at least. I'll feel better when we know that for sure. We need to check the whole house. <sighs> All right, fine. You and me will take the upstairs. Lee, you've got down here. Make sure you check every door, understand? Okay. <laughs> that will remember that. Can I help? What if there's another locked door? I think you've been helpful enough for one day, kiddo. Why don't you just see if Kristen and Omid need anything, okay? Okay. That's a kind of funny way to say it. Get lost. Wait. Food, maybe? Give me some snackies? No, my goal. Oh, Potatoes! I'm not that hungry. Signs I need to finish checking the downstairs. Upstairs? Kenny and Ben have the second floor covered. I should finish checking down here. Ooh! There's gotta be monster in here. This is gonna be like a library. Or like a study. All clear in here. What is this? Not exactly my style. Yeah, it's a penny of uh, 1922 Picazzi from uh, old Great Britain. After the war, it's uh, a gift they give to the queen. Nothing hiding in here. Just one more to check. What is that? Looks expensive and heavy. Doubt any looters would be able to haul that thing too far. Wait, what do they care what if it's expensive? Probably not the best idea right now. I need to stay frosty. Yeah, but I'll call upon the wound. What does it say? My dog Walter. <sighs> to me, if there was an apocalypse, I think looting would be the bar one of the, one of the funnest part of it. Must have stopped working a while ago. <laughs> it's like opening things, you know. Hey guys. How's the house looking? Not done searching the first floor yet, but so far, so good. How's that couch treating you, Omi? Leg feeling better yet? I'm all right. I feel you. <laughs> Sit tight. I'll keep checking the first floor to make sure it's safe. Thanks, Lee. No problem, honey.
Okay, definitely a bunch of walkers in here, boys. The whole family. Jesus! Shit, I got you baited. What? What happened? It's nothing. Just uh, nothing. Well, place ain't got much. We should be okay here for a while. At least until it quiets down outside. Good. Thanks. Is he okay? Yeah, for now. But I'm really worried his leg might have gotten infected. Don't suppose you turned up any meds while you were poking around? Nah, just dog food. And there's some whiskey in the back. I was just asking Clementine if she knows who the man on her radio is. It's okay, honey. You can tell us. Who is he? What does he want? Clementine. Just right. to ask you a question, and both of us would like an answer. Who have you been talking to? I don't know. He said he was a friend. He said he could help me find my mom and dad. I told him we were looking for them in Savannah. Clementine, look at me. What else have you told this man? Lee? Useless. Please, you need to get up here now. What's going on? Is he turning it? Kenny. Kenny said he thought he heard something up there. Went to go look. He's up there? I can't get him to come down. Fell asleep, hung himself, got bitten. Stay here. Passed out, got drunk. Got drunk off. The gun is highlighted, I don't like that. Kenny? Is he praying? Kenny, you okay, man? Oh, Jesus. What the hell is that? How did you get there? Oh, it's not his kid. Kinda looks like Duck, don't he? He looks like it. It's just a kid. What the hell happened to him? Ain't nothing on him. Guess he must have been hiding out up here. Starved to death. Jesus Christ. I don't know if I can, Lee. Couldn't do it before. Can't do it now. I got this. I can't ask you to do this, man. I'll take care of it. Like I did before. Are you sure? I guess we'll find out. I'll squash his head like a fucking cockroach, dude. Fuck him. Poor kid. Must have tried to hide out up here until he starved to death. This could have been Clementine if I hadn't found no idea. The stomp, the bash, or the shoot? Stomp. It just collapsed. We should bury him. I'll take care of it. That's fucking disgusting. Okay, so imagine the fun that it is at 
at Christmas to open a lot of gifts that you don't know what's inside, right? What about a lot of like rich houses? You know what's inside? They could be boring stuff like books, like designer lamps, or it could be like PlayStations and TVs and shit like that, right? So looting it would be just amazing if there was like an apocalypse. It'd be like Christmas, every house. You know, you don't know what you're gonna get. So sad. It's Walter and Christophe. Pay respects, chat. Can I get some candles in chat? Rest in peace. Is the kid okay? He shifted. We just, we just squished him. Sorry, you had to see that. Oh my fucking god, dude. Hey! Hey, come back, hey. motherfucker! You come back here, I'll kill you! You oh. understand? I'll kill you! Is the mic talking about the game volume? What's going on? saw someone standing there by the fence, watching us. A walker? No, too fast. Took off like a bat out of hell when I spotted him. Was it a man or a woman? Didn't get a good enough look. What does it matter? I'm wondering if it's the same guy who's been following us. The guy on the radio. Hmm. Kenny? I'm fine. I just... I'm fine. What's all the rockets? Lee saw someone watching us from outside the gate. What? Who? I can't be sure. They ran off before I could get a good look. I don't like this one bit. Not one bit. Me either. Walkers are one thing, but the thought of someone out there actually stalking us. All right, that's it. We've stuck around here long enough. It's time to get back on track. Time to get down to the river and find ourselves a boat. I don't know if Omid's well enough to move yet. Well, he better get ready, because I'm going down to River Street right now to find a boat. And as soon as she's ready to go, we're moving out. Let's go. Oh, Kitty. The sooner we get the hell out of here, the better. Well, then, hell, what are we waiting for? I'll go get my stuff. No. Ben, you'll only slow us down. Lee and I can go scout the river while the rest of you get ready to move out. You stay behind with Krista and Omid. Wait, can't I come? My mom and dad can't be far now. Maybe we can look for them on the way to the river. Nope. There's no way I'm letting you go back out there. But maybe I can help. Kenny and I'll be fine. You're gonna stay right here where it's safe. No arguments. Okay. Daylight's burning. Gonna go grab my gear, then we'll head out. Come on, Clem. Let's go see if Omid needs anything. So, you're just gonna leave me on the bench here? Yep. Benched Ben. That's his name. That's not how it is, Ben. I need you to stay here and keep an eye on Clementine. I can do that. Well, just so we're clear. While I'm gone, anything or anyone tries to get inside this house, you shoot them. Don't even think twice about it. Understand? I got no problem shooting walkers. Did you hear what I said? 
anything or anyone. Good. Bad choice, he's a coward. Infected? East Bay and Lincoln. Where's he going? RLW Hey, uh, so you want to talk about it? About what? About what happened back there in the attic. No. You sure, man? I mean, rivers right up ahead. Son of a bitch. That bastard's fucking with us again. It's another trap. No, listen. That's not the same bell as before. This one's further off. Whatever it is, it's gonna get the dead moving over there. Ah, oh, shit, man. What in the hell is going on? Ringing that is just trying to distract us, create a diversion. That's my call, man. I find whoever's doing that, I'll ring their motherfucking bell for them. Good you one. fucking tell them. Good, good one. Good one, Kenny. Hmm. Let's keep moving. Still nothing moving behind us. I think we're. the plan Lee this is our best and only shot you said so yourself back at the house you agreed with me yeah but that was before we there's no boats what's he gonna do build a raft this one might still be salvageable Better be right about this. I said it might be. Give me a fucking break. I'm a fishing captain, not a miracle worker. Jesus. I'll check it out. You look further along the waterfront. Maybe there's something at the other end. I don't think we should split up too far. We don't have to. See that telescope? You can see all the way along the waterfront from right here. See what you can find. Okay. True, actually. It's not like a tourist area. It's not like ten bucks to like look through or some shit. You have to like some coins. Whoa! Great. Needs a quarter to work. Yeah, I told you. I'm broke as shit. Pipe it. That'll do it. Damn. Built solid. I don't think I'm gonna see anything until I find a quarter. I thought I could pipe it. I'm oh, like shit. Fuck. What is this meant to be? Some kind of warning? Do something like this. 
I did. No, don't shoot. What the fuck? Maybe we have to. Better not. Grimfire would just bring more walkers. I thought I wanted to kill him and check his pockets for some gold. What the hell are these markings? They're all over the place. Doff, RFB, I think, and DMR. The fuck? Why don't they even let me go here if there's nothing in here? There you go! This is episode 4. Beautiful. Empty. Yeah, that would have been too easy. Loot Andes did. have taken weeks to board up all these windows. Weeks? More like a couple hours? Looks like the whole city has been boarded up for all the good it did. I should probably stick close to Kenny. It's too dangerous out here. Wait, we had a quarter a while back when we uh unscrewed the thing. Oh, right there. This barricade does a good job of making me not want to go any further. Could be military tags, but what do they mean? Two X. Yeah, I mean, we, we need to check the whole, the whole place. Oh, in this, yes, in this. Locked. Smack it. Wrench it, baby. Fuck it. Bang. It's flat. Yeah, just like when you're young and you go to like um, the pharmacy or whatever, and there's like these uh, these candy distribution machines, and, and you just fucking smack them until they uh, start spinning some juice. Fuck! What's up with the boat? It ain't gonna work. Hulls crack beneath the waterline, plus someone stripped out the battery. You can't fix it? What the? What the hell is that? A fate worse than death. Abandoned, like every other place in this city. Looking for a boat. Oh, what is that? Yeah, docks. No boats. Yeah, no shit. No way that one's salvageable. Talmadge Memorial Bridge. Can't imagine how many people tried to escape across it when the city started to fall. Nothing but water, not a boat to be seen. What the hell? What is that? An ice pick? On cement? Get down! Someone came down from that building at the end of the street. Where'd he go? Saw him run into that newsstand. Could be our bell ringer. How about we go find out? Go! Sounds like a plan. Of course. Okay. You head up the middle of the street. I'll go around the side, cover your flank. 
will come up on him quiet, taken by surprise. Look at the smile. <laughs> Just want to talk to this guy. Oh, we're gonna talk. The fuck? No, I did. I clicked. <sighs> he shadow stepped me. No. Clem. Please don't hurt him. You're not from Crawford. Who the fuck is this? You're not the guy on the radio. I'm not a guy at all. Full marks for observation. Oh, hands up. Get her. Who the hell are you people? I ask you first. The name's Molly. Molly? I'm Lee. This is Kenny and Clementine. We're not looking for any trouble. Hi. Hi. You guys really aren't from Crawford, are you? I don't have to tell you anything. Nice. You're gonna go far with that attitude. I have the gun. What happened to the people here? You sure you wanna know? When everything started going to shit, some people got together and sealed off that whole neighborhood. Folks willing to do anything to stay alive, stop the dead getting in. I try to avoid them. Why? Let's just say they have a zero tolerance policy for anyone who won't or can't live by their rules. So how'd you know we weren't them? Because there are no children in Crawford. Not anymore. Uh oh. Why not? What do you mean, no children? Why not? No children, no elderly, no one with an advanced medical condition. Good. Basically, no one who might be a burden on the community. Crawford's all about the survival of the fittest. That's how they survived. All the rest of the world went to shit around them. Jesus Christ. Well, just the opposite when you think about it. That's not how our group does things. You're not saying they actually... I mean, I mean, kids? No, the children, they just forced to leave, along with their parents. Left them to fend for themselves out here in the world. Why? Like I said, zero tolerance. Crawford got rid of anyone that couldn't pitch in, pull their own weight. The way they looked at it, those people were just a lot of useless mouths to feed. A True. drain on their precious resources. How do you know all this? Everyone in Savannah knew. What was going on inside Crawford got passed around like a ghost story. Except this one was true. Well, sorry. Do you know who's been ringing those bells it's all the time? Yeah, that would be me. I knew it. Lee, I knew she was the one who's been following us. Fucking with us. 
Get that finger out of my face, Grandpa, before I jam it straight up your ass. I haven't been following you. I don't even know who the hell you people are. Well, please do. Calm down, Kenny. The voice on the radio was a guy, remember? Yeah, well, whoever you are, ringing those bells this morning nearly got us all killed. Raise the dead all around us. That's the idea, genius. It's how I get around. I ring a bell in one neighborhood to attract the local geeks towards it. Buys me some time to scavenge the areas they cleared out. Geeks? Is that what you call them? Yeah, you know, like at the carnival? They'll eat anything, alive or dead. That was pretty smart with the bells. Doesn't take much to outsmart the dead. Bunch of dumbasses. You just gotta move fast, get in and out before they start to wander back again. Look, I'm gonna ask you people again. You're not from Crawford, so who the hell are you? What are you doing here? Came down here looking for a boat, hoping to get our people out of here. You wanna get the fuck out? Yeah, good luck with that. Anyone with a boat took it out of here as soon as people started eating each other. Any that got left behind, Crawford stripped them for parts. Cars, too. There's gotta be something. If there was, do you think I'd still be here? I've been over every inch of this city. This whole place is picked clean. God damn it! Fuck! Hey, moron. You wanna keep your voice down? Shit. Since you're not getting on any boat, I'd advise you folks to go back to where you came from before... Great. Just great. Isn't that the... Fuck. Gunshot must have brought him back. Isn't there another way back to the house? Bob, is there a... Aw, oh, dude! The fuck?! gonna let her go? Hey! You can't just leave us here! Really? Watch! No! Please! Please don't leave us! Ah, oh, she's weak. The emotions. Come on! Make it fast! Oh, fuck me! Come on! Come on! Hurry! Come on! Come on! What the fuck, dude? Glass of okay. Jump over it. Come on, Lee, get your ass out of there. And the sewers we go, baby. The prior. Here, use that to pry it open. Oh shit, boys! Where's the pick? Jesus. Clementine, can you hear me? Stop making noise, idiot. If you can hear me, just get back to the house, okay? I'll meet you there. Shit. We saw the pickaxe. Maybe we can pry it out? Built solid. Built solid. That's a bad man. Ooh, a slider. He's gonna fall. Ah! Fuck. Slippery. What is that? A valve? It's a drainage pipe. We have to find a wheel for it.
Crouch. Right here. Wait, we have to de-screw it, so left side. Don't turn in that direction. Really? You're in the sewers. Why would you want to put the water in? Good thing I'm out here and not in there. Seems loose. Shit. Yeah, debolted, baby. There it is. Oh, what the? Son, man. Use the ice pick, motherfucker! Are you kidding? Empty coconut head! Empty coconut head, dude. And these controls did push it. Oh, pry it. Ugh. Wait, where's the zombie? There it is. I told you guys we had this dude easy clap. We clapped it hardcore. Spin it to the right. What's that gonna do for us? Hell no. We're gonna circle back around it. Since they heard the noise, they're gonna go forward. It. So, the, so would the walker in the out main. It. See? Jibated. A revolver. Oh my God. Chuck. Chuck. He must have tried to hide out down here. Poor bastard. Oh no. No bullets. He must have saved the last one for himself. You deserve better, old man. Fuck it. Dude, I knew it. Ha! Fuck! Whoa! Cut it! Tap run! We did it. No dumping.
Can we make it? What the hell? Oh, the secret passage. old nuclear fallout shelters the supplies look at all this it's enough to keep people alive for months those exist in real life who are you it's all right it's okay. Oh, uh, I don't want any trouble. Neither do we. Uh, which is why you'd do well to turn around and leave right now. Look, I'm sorry I disturbed you folks. I'll just be going. You can't let him leave. He's from Crawford. If he goes back there and they find out we're down here. Are you from Crawford? They don't lie to me. I'll know. Where else can he be from? Everywhere else around here is dead. I think you better start talking. I'm not from around here. I'm from Athens. Grew up in Macon. I have a brother in Macon. You were there. How was it? As bad as here. I'm sorry. You can't trust him, Vernon. You can't let him leave. What do you want me to do? Shoot him in the head? Why not? Be more of a mercy than anyone from Crawford ever showed us. Think, Vernon. What do you think they'll do if they find out we're down here, right under their feet? Damn it. You're right. I'm sorry, friend. Shut up! The risk. Don't listen to the pig! But I saw what they did up there. Sick. I'm not like them, and I don't think you are either. I think you're a good man. Keep back, or I swear I'll shoot. It's all Jimmy. right. It's okay. Vernon, what the hell are you doing? Shut up, pig. Vernon! Relax. I'm not here to hurt you. You're really not from Crawford? No, I'm really not. Well, we are, or were. We got out of there when they started sealing up the place, you know, started weeding out the sick and the old so the perfect survivor society wouldn't be threatened. No room for weakness or vulnerability in their little master race. You don't look that old, so you're sick? We're sick. We're all members of a cancer survivors group that used to meet here at the hospital. We're in remission. But that wasn't good enough for Crawford. They'd already rounded up five of us before the rest of us managed to hole up and hide from them down here. This old basement's been abandoned for years. What is this? The morgue? Yeah. Irony's always high on my list when I'm looking for a place to survive. How did you find your way down here? A few of us got boxed in by walkers up on the street. Came down here trying to get away. Now I just want to get out of here and get back to my own people. Well, that sewer system you came through runs all over the city. It'll take you wherever you want to go. Thanks, man. Those sewers are like a damn maze. Any chance you could help me find my way back? Look, I'd like to help you, but we've all got our own problems. Two of our group are sick and need constant care, and I'm the only doctor here. Besides, why should we help you? Shut up, Cal. Jesus Christ. If you've got sick people here, maybe I can help. Our group has medical supplies. What kind of medical supplies? I don't know. All kinds. I'm sure there's something you could use. We'd be happy to trade some for a guide back to where we're staying. Vern, we need medicine. Joyce is in a lot of pain. I can't bear to see her like this. Maybe it's worth the risk. Maybe so. We need you here. Don't worry. I'll be all right. Easy. He's all this shit. Guys, it's not a lie, it's called a white lie. It's a non-verifiable statement. 
and that gets me to where I need to go. So it doesn't matter. So when we go to our group, medicine or not, we can just kill them. And when Clementine? We... Clem? Molly? Oh, hey, you made it back. Who's this? He didn't tell you about me? Understandable, I guess. I'm the one who put that beating on him when he tried to jump me back at the river. Who's the fossil? <laughs> this is Vernon. He's a doctor. He helped me get back here after we got separated. I think you have something that belongs to me. My love? Oh. If you lie to a character and then you kill him, you didn't lie, the lie disappears. It was never verified. Thank God you're back. Krista, what's wrong? It's Omid. He's gotten worse. Much worse. Omid? A man wounded. Who's this? This is Vernon. He's a doctor. Oh, thank God. Could you take a look at him? I'll need to see those medical supplies. What medical supplies? Uh, sorry, Doc. Had to get you on board somehow. Well, you just get better and better, don't you? Easy. You have to help us. Please. I'll see what I can do. Take me to him. Omid, honey, you're gonna be all right. Lee brought a doctor. All right, let's take a look at him. I work better without an audience. I'm sure you have more things of your own to attend to. You get two viewers, chill out, dude. Clementine. Clementine? Where is she? Clementine, you in here? Where is she? She's hidden behind. Boo! Clementine? I'll have time to rest later. What is that? Them's drawings, but where is she? Is that me? Oh, she's inside. Clem, you in here? Don't see her anywhere out there. Uh, no walkers either, though. Doesn't look like she's in here. And she's sad. Clementine, you hear? Oh! Clementine, you up there? Shit. Thank you. You're welcome. I saw that earlier. I just wish you would let me finish my sentence sometime. I couldn't hear anything. So tell me you can't hear me. It's not that hard. Hello? Okay. 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 What are you doing? Oh, uh, you know, just poking around. You won't find anything. We already searched the place. You'd be surprised what people miss. Trust me, I've been doing this for a while. Where's Clementine? Don't ask me, I'm not her keeper. Hey. Do I look like I'm in the mood to be jerked around? Where did she go? Last I saw, she was downstairs with your redneck friend and that college kid who hangs around with him. My I what? Bug them. Molly? My I sense. told you, that girl isn't with me. Go ask your buddies and quit bothering me. Oh, baby, baby. 
want that. I just want to find Clementine. And then why is it an option? Can we hit in here? Wait, what? In here for sure. Sleeping. Oh. Clem? Clementine? Clementine! Come out! Please! The broom again. Dude, she doesn't look like she's in here. This suspense is kind of odd in its timing. She's just hidden somewhere. She needs to go boo somewhere. Kenny? Oh hey, you made it back. Good job. Good job. What the hell do you think you're doing? What does it look like? Where'd you get the bottle? Oh, Found there. it. You want to throw down again like back on the train? Because I fight better when I'm shit-faced. Kenny, come on. Give me that. Kenny, give me the damn bottle. Get the fuck away from me. Getting wasted's not going to help anyone. Yeah? Well, what is? We are fucked. Molly said there's not a single boat left in Savannah. No way out. We got walkers all around us. That crazy fuck on the radio messing with us. Hell, if now ain't the time for a drink? What? Ah. Doesn't look like she's in here. Have either of you seen Clementine? Damned if I know. Gotta be around here somewhere. Ben, I gave you one job when I left here. Take care of Clementine. Then she shows up out on River Street looking for me. What the hell happened? Hey, don't put all that on me. Omid took a turn for the worse, and Krista asked me to help. I'm sorry, I'm doing the best I can here. She was frantic, and things got kind of crazy. I told Clementine to stay put. Shut the fuck what up. What could I do? Don't be sorry. Just tell me where the hell she is now. I think she went out to play in the backyard. On her own. With no one watching her? Man, will you get off my back? She's fine out there. She better be or it's your ass. Or did I kill him, dude? Guys, the what? The one opportunity we get, we're gonna fucking pop a cap on us. Clementine? Done with this guy, dude. Clementine! Stupid bitch ass. In the garage, probably. Because the camera's backwards now. Don't think anyone came in through there. What did I say? What did I say? So what? What's wrong, guys? Across? I heard that. The fuck are you doing? in there exploring and look look what I found a fucking boat holy shit, shit. 
swear. <laughs> She'll remember that. Yeah. Fucking drunk hobo. If we leak it, then we have a boat, they're gonna kill us. What's taking Kenny so damn long? How hard can it be to look over a boat? It'll take as long as it takes, Lee. Will you quit pacing? You're making everyone nervous. Why are you even still here? Hey, if your friend really can get that boat working, you're taking me with you as payment for saving your asses. Uh, I no. figure that's fair enough, don't you? And no mega lol. Well? You want the good news or the bad news? We need parts. Let's get the bad news out of the way first. Bad news is, she's not taking us anywhere the shape she's in right now. Gas tank's empty and the battery's dead. So that's what's fine. the good news? That's it. That's all she needs. Some gas and a battery. Other than that, she's good to go. Well, how are we supposed to get that stuff? We should go back out on the street, see what we can find. That's not gonna work. Did they strip it? took everything and brought it inside their walls. They siphoned every gas tank, stripped every battery. There's nothing left out there. You saw that for yourselves. She's right. Well, what about this Crawford place? Sounds like they'd have everything we need. Maybe we should try there. Now hold on a minute. Surely gonna, we have to try. They're gonna know. If there are people left in this city who are still alive, who still have supplies, what harm can it do to ask? Trust me, you don't know these people. I do. You showing up with a wounded man, might as well put a noose around his neck. They don't exactly welcome children with open arms either. What the hell kind of a place are we talking about here? The worst kind? But I don't see what other choice we have. And just how exactly do you figure we do this? Because from what I've heard, that place ain't exactly friendly to outsiders. That's putting it mildly. Force. We're armed and we've got the numbers. I say we just go in there and take what we need by force. Okay, that is literally the dumbest idea I have ever heard. Crawford's like a goddamn military base. They've got hundreds of people in there armed to the teeth. And not perimeters guarded day and night. You're gonna have to be smarter than that. Oh, maybe we can be. I know the sewer system that runs beneath Crawford like the back of my hand. Y'all wouldn't happen to have a map by any chance. Yeah, actually. I think Oof. that could lead us through so we could pass under the perimeter and right into the center where they keep their supplies. We come up right underneath them, take them by surprise, grab what we need, and get out before they even knew what hit them. Okay, that's not bad. That's better. I've thought about it before, just never had the people to do it. But I think if we all work together, we could pull it off. Chess master. What do you want in return for all this help you're giving us? Crawford doesn't just have what you need for your boat. They're also well stocked with medical supplies. Medicine that my people could use, just as yours could. We can do this. We have to. So, it's decided then? We're going to Crawford? We Let's fucking do, do it. This. I know it. Hell yeah, we can. Are we seriously talking about this? I mean, what about the risk? I don't know about you, kid, but I'd rather take a chance on doing something than just sitting around here waiting to die. That boat out there is an answered prayer. Just gotta push a little bit farther. Are you in or out? We should go tonight, under cover of dark. I'll go let my people know. Give you all a chance to prepare. I'll be back before midnight. Be careful. That's how I'm still alive. I told you to stay in your room. How long have you been there? Is it going to be dangerous? It's what going to be dangerous? Crawford. I can't lie to you, Cliff. Honesty points. It's going to be dangerous. But it's the only way to get the things we need to make Omi better and get the boat working. That's why we have to do this. Do you understand? 
I don't want anyone else to die. That could happen. But we have to take that risk because it's just as dangerous not to. True. I guess I should go get ready. Uh, say what now? You said you'd need all of us to do this, and you said I'm a big help, remember? Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. That means it must be where my mom and dad are, right? Where I'm going, it's just too dangerous. For children especially. You said I'm supposed to always stay close to you. Can't I come with you? No, my girl. Okay, you can count. Oh, I had to choice to stay quiet and do exactly what you're told the whole time we're there. Okay, I'm gonna go get ready. This is gonna fucking get killed. They're gonna put on a stick, dude, and feed her to the zombies. Check out what I found in the garage. Hatchet, hacksaw, some other tools. Might come in handy on this little break-in. Nice. Can I talk to you a minute? Sure, man. What's up? I took another look at the boat. She's a 30-footer. So? So, we're gonna have a capacity problem. Boat that size ain't gonna hold more than five people. Even Kill with him. one of them a kid. Me, you, Clem, Krista, Omi, Ben, Bobby. Assuming everyone makes it back alive, that's still one too many. Even if we cut Molly loose. Before this is over, we're gonna have to make a decision. You're not serious. Look, I'm just saying, if we want the best chance of... Ben can hit the road. Fuck no. Who the hell is this? It's my cow. Bree, she can help us. What the fuck is her name again? No. We don't need her. She's just gonna slow us down. I was a student at the school where Crawford keeps their supplies. I know the layout. With her help, we're in and out faster. Anyone have a problem with that? I guess not. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get moving. Hold up just a sec. You ready? Ready. Hey, whoa, hold on a minute. You're not taking her with us. Did you not hear anything I said about the kind of place Crawford is? Shut if the fuck up, If you take her in Crust. there and they find her... This isn't up for debate, Vernon. Decision's made. For what it's worth, I don't think it's a great idea either. She's coming. Deal with it. You heard the man. Let's move out. Yoink. Dude, why is he talking shit? They don't like... Old people and children, and he's old. He has just the same amount of chances of finding as her. If anything, we should. Be it. We're right underneath the center of Crawford. The old school should be directly above us. Okay, people, this is it. Remember the plan. We go in hard, hit them by surprise, grab what we need, and get the hell out. We need to do this fast, so everybody stay sharp, stay alert, and stay close together. Got it? Got it. And that part about staying close, it goes double for you. Shh. Let's go. Let's go. Wait, you guys see that over there? Is it the ice pick? Is everybody? There should be guards patrolling. What? Are you disappointed? It's just strange. It's bugged. I think I see one over there by the door. Okay, me and Kenny will take this.
this guy out. On my signal, the rest of you follow us over. Everybody got it? Okay, Kenny, let's do this quiet. No shooting unless there's no other choice. Right behind you. Don't fucking move. This is a zombie, dude. I ain't gonna tell you again. What the fuck? I had no choice. What the fuck is a walker doing inside here? Get inside. Fast. What the fuck? There's a whole bunch of them. Smile at him. Fuck, fuck. What are you doing? Do you think they saw us? Nope. I don't think so. I think we're good. For now, at least. What the hell happened here? I thought this place was supposed to be secure. What always happens, I guess. In the end. The dead always win. Oh man, we are so screwed. So I've done. No, this is good. What? How the fuck is this good? Before, everyone at Crawford was smart and they had guns. Now they're dumb and they don't. Hey, trying to look on the bright side here. I agree. So long as we don't let them box us in, we can still do this. The plan hasn't changed. The plan hasn't changed? Every time walkers show up, the plan changes. Do you even have any idea how many of them are out there? No. You want to do a head count? Or do you want to get what we need and get the hell out of here? What is he? He looks like a I troll. Know. I think I know which way to head. Wait. Then she she needed layouts? I have a bad feeling about this. Dude, nobody cares what this guy says. He's a beta male. Just keep moving. Uh, there's an X on it. Here. Looks okay. Everybody in. Nice, I dare you, Cal. Armory. Figures. Looks like they were using this room as some kind of command center. Okay, so now what? Where do we start looking? The armory? Here. Just give me a sec. Processing. Loading data, boys. Any idea where we could find a battery? Maybe at the auto shop. There used to be one in the alley outside the fire escape. Yep, it's called Herman's. You can't miss it. Okay, where can we find some fuel for the boat? There's a maintenance shed across from the playground here. If they were storing fuel, that's probably where it'll be. What about the medicine? 
Right here. Nurse's station. They were using it as a medical facility. How do you know that? Just makes sense, doesn't it? Okay. I'll make the run to the maintenance shed for the fuel. It'll be faster if I go with you. I can take you right to it. I'll come too. No, two people's enough. You stay here, see if you can use any of those tools we brought to get that armory door open. You might need to shoot our way out of here. I'll go for the medicine. I'll come with you. I know what to take. Okay. Guess that leaves me to go find us a battery. I'll go with you. Watch your back. Okay, we've got a plan. Is that what I'm Stay close to one another. We'll all meet back here. Good luck. Ben always benched. Feels given. What about me? What can I do? I need you to stay here with Ben and watch over our command center. I'm putting you in charge of it, okay? You're leaving me with Ben? I'm not leaving you with Ben. I'm leaving him with you. Understand? <laughs> True. Oh, okay. <sighs> Back before you know. <laughs> the Georgia State flag. A lot of history there. Not that it matters much now, I guess. Let's get the fuck out of here. Okay, here we go. Way to the auto shops down here. You coming or not? Chill out. Shell casing is shipping up. I've already been fired. They're worthless. What the fuck? Anything around here, boys? It's making so much noise. You out here? She got ambushed. Guess I'm not going that way. The lever's made in the rear. I saw that! I saw it. Fuck, man. This is the place I'm looking for. Well, climbing the fence isn't an option. Climb over there and jump over it. Uh, maybe to the right? No. Back alley, maybe? So go over the fence. Right side? It's our only option. Maybe we'll find like a car or something. Looters will be shot. There it is. Oh god, it's gonna break. It's about to fucking break! Holy shit, Ninja Warrior. Damn, it's jammed tight. That's it. We're dead. Get too close. Hit 
There's a knife. It's a, it's a surgeon. He's mine. What were you doing what up the there? Fuck you doing? Psycho! What the hell do you think you're doing? It's dead already. I think you could lay off. Don't tell me what to do. You kill geeks your way, I'll kill him mine. Damn. Jesus, lay off the juice. He's wearing medical scrubs. Some kind of scientist or doctor, maybe? Yeah, well, he ain't shit now. Did you find us a way in? Yeah, but the garage door's jammed. Can't raise it. Not a problem. Look what I found. A jack? Yep. Oh yeah, that'll work. There's a fence, dude. Oh, it's brilliant, of course. Is it Q time? It's Q time, boys! Take a look around. I'll make sure no stragglers get under this door. Got it. Too high. I can't reach it up there. But I have power. No power. Yeah. More of Crawford's rules. How did anybody live like this? I'd rather take my chances on the outside. It's locked. The, the alarm. No way in. Looks like it's the hose for the lift hydraulics. Maybe we can like tape it together or something. Ooh! Battery and fuel, boys! Well, I can see where the battery should be, but it's not. Perfect. What? Huh? Looks like Crawford had their own semi trucks. An item. Can I get the back? That's my thought. Something you need? Think I can borrow that uh, hook thing of yours? It's not a hook. I don't know. Hilda and I have been through a lot together. Hilda? Who's That's on? what I call her. Don't judge. Please, can I borrow Hilda? I'll take good care of her. <laughs> she won't get a scratch. I got your promise now. Not a scratch. Do we break the... Oh, pick it together. <laughs> I did it. Why the music? Whoa, whoa. Oh God! That's probably not good. No shit! I'll try to hold him off. Hurry! There's the battery. Finally, something goes right. Shit. Um. Fast, so used to be cocky. Come on. Still attached to the terminals. The terminals? Got that one off. It's off. Got it. Got it. Yeah, but we still got a problem here. Put it in here. I'll carry it. 
Okay, follow me. Move your ass! Yeah, I'm trying! She's dressed athletic for me, dude! Okay. Damn! A muscle up! Dude, she muscle up! Dude, who is this? The fucking Hulk, dude? Now we're on the roof. Do you ever stop complaining? Come on. What are you, chicken? Jump! Yo, I'm not Peter Parker, man! What did you call me? Well, now that you mention it... Woo! The fuck? Dude, dude, that would've flung her downwards. Come on. Later. Something I gotta do first. What? Catch you later. Wait, yeah. you still got the battery? Yeah, I think I'll hold on to it. Make sure you don't leave without me. See you back in class. Molly! Damn it, what the hell is she doing? Come on. Can't open it without the combination. Yeah, no shit. Hey guys, isn't it? You guys need any help? Thanks, but I think we're almost in. We're taking care of it, Lee. Don't worry. You sure you two don't need any help? We're taking care of it, Lee. Don't worry. She's using uh, urban techniques, boys. Very urban. Yes. Little help! Little help here! The fuck? Hey, stand back, motherfucker! Fuck! Fuck, the doors won't close all the way! Will do something! Don't. We got it. Break the door with something! Got it. Put it in. Put it in. Got a hold. Damn well better. There's so many. We got the fuel. We got the Let's juice. Not start high fiving each other just yet. Let's get the hell back to the classroom. It's a hand with these fuel cans. They weigh a goddamn ton. And she's gone again. You're back. Yeah, and we made out pretty good too. Great work, Kenny. How you doing with that door? Not so good. Here, let me give you a hand. Did you get that battery yet? Yeah, Molly has it. She should be back here soon. She'd better be. Did he can't even do the most basic urban technique. Are you serious, Looks like they have quite a system here. Crawford's final solution. TMR? He's trying it, he's useless. Number of citizens. Number of ineligible citizens found. Number of walkers found. Initials of person conducting search. Day since outbreak. That's pretty smart. What do we still need? We already got the fuel and the battery. Once we find some medicine, we'll be good to go. So where's this battery you found? Molly has it. She ran off to do something. Well, she'd better bring it back here. 
I don't know why you trusted that girl with it. We hardly know her. She saved your life, didn't she? <laughs> yeah, but what has she done for me lately? No, wait. There is something you can help me with. Something that's been on my mind. I could use your opinion. What is it? What is it? It's Kenny. Since I've been helping him work on the boat, I've gotten to know him a little better. He's a good guy, you know? And it's eating me up knowing what I know. I've been thinking about telling him the truth. Ben, come on. This again? It's my fault Duck and Katja got killed. If I hadn't screwed up back at the motor inn, they'd still be alive. How am I supposed to just carry something like that around? I have to tell him. Ben, no offense, but have you, you done lost your motherfucking mind? Kenny's barely hanging on. You tell him you're to blame? Exactly. I don't even want to think about what he might do. Well, that's good. I know. I've thought about that. But I don't know how much longer I can keep looking him in the eye. I feel like I'm lying to him by not telling I'm him. I'm telling you, man, it's a bad idea. Real. Real bad. Hey, maybe you're okay walking around with somebody's blood on your hands, but that's not who I am. I can't just pretend it never happened. I'm convinced. Y you win. Look, we need Kenny. We need him to hold his shit together if we're ever gonna get out of here. So you need to keep this to yourself, for the good of everyone. You hear me? I hear you. I'm gonna get back to this. Fuck. Lucky dude, what is that over there? A plushie? Creepy. Jesus Christ. Might come back for these later. Any reading material would be nice once we get on that boat. Reading? Stop. <laughs> How about what about the cow? Free? No offense, but I'm not really looking for conversation. What's wrong? Nothing's wrong. I just don't particularly like you. If this is about Vernon, I did what I had to do to get him to help us. I was only looking out for my people. And I'm looking out for mine. That's the only reason I'm here. So, if there's nothing else... She just doesn't trust me. Holy shit. You okay, Clem? Yeah. This desk is just like the ones we have in my school. I know it's weird, but I kind of miss it, being in school. Me too. I used to be a teacher, remember? Tell you what, when we find ourselves a safe place, set up a little classroom. Just you and me. Will there be homework? No homework. Smiley face. Where's Molly? She had to go run an air. She'll be back soon. I hope she's okay. She'll be fine. She's pretty tough. Do you think things will ever be normal again? Just like the way they were before? No. I don't think so, Claire. I think the best we can hope for is that we'll find a way to survive, to stay together, and to not let this change us. That's what's important. Honestly. Yes, you're right. What's over here? Nothing? Was that ketchup? Just a bunch of paste. The globe. I have to wonder what's going on in the rest of the world. Are they done? How are you guys doing with that door? Slower than I'd like. Don't worry, we'll get it open. I think. No power, no TV. My prediction? We need two people to die, right? Ben and Molly will both die. Hopscotch. And then the boat will have enough place for us. Nothing but crayons and construction paper. Here we go. Oh, 
Oh shit, we can go there. Can't reach it. It's too high up. Don't be a prissy man. Shit. Whoa! Kristen Vernon must be trapped in there. Bad idea, dude. Is there an, an adoption? How about this? One. Big. Huge. Insane. Crazy. Wicked. Wandered into the hallway after we got inside. I think they must have heard us rooting around in here. The whole place is infested. They're everywhere. Calm down. I took care of them. What about the mids? Did we find what we need? Yeah, that's our other problem. Take a look. Looks like they were keeping all the prescription meds in that safe, locked up tight. There's no way we can bust it open. Maybe with enough time, but I don't know how much of that we have. Be a hell of a lot quicker if we just knew the four-digit combination. Well, I doubt they just wrote it down and left it here for us to find. We should just try busting it open. We don't have any other choice. Okay, you get started. I'll take a look around, see if I can find anything useful. Puzzle time. No tape inside. No, don't. Y'all already checked these drawers? Yes, Lee. Nothing in there worth taking. We're about to back. Oh, we're here. Uh, already cleaned out. Right here. Some kind of medical file. Anna Correa. Guess she must have been a patient here. And what's this? Number. 9082? Was that it? Vernon, Krista, come look at this. This is day 82 since the outbreak. 1547. Dr. Logan in consultation with patient Anna Correa. Why are you recording this? Regulations. Oberson has ordered me to keep records of all medical examinations and consultations. I need you to brace yourself, Anna. The sonogram confirms that you're pregnant. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. As you know, the rules are very clear. The termination is mandatory. You don't have to tell them. Tell them it was just nausea. But you gave me something for it and it went away. This is my problem, not yours. If Oberson finds out that I concealed evidence of a pregnancy, I'm sorry, but these are the rules. I'm gonna give you a sedative. It'll make the procedure easier on you. The fuck? I want the procedure! I want my baby! I can't do this! I can't do this! Anna, you don't have a choice. Now, if you like, you can take some time with this. But I need you to come back no later than tomorrow. Or I'll have no choice but to inform Oberson myself. I'm sorry. Put the code, motherfucker. Damn it. We almost had it. What the hell kind of place was this? Like Molly said, the worst kind. Lee, maybe there's another tape. We gotta keep looking. I think I recognize that doctor. He was one of the walkers out in the alley by the auto shop. Maybe you should search it. See what he's got on him. Nice. 
928. This is day 82. Since no! Outbreak. 1547. Dr. Logan in consultation with patient Anna Correa. Why are you recording this? Regulations. Oberson has ordered me to keep records of all medical examinations and consultations. I need you to brace yourself, Anna. The sonogram confirms that you're pregnant. Oh, it's God. not clickable. Oh, God. It's not clickable, chat. No, the rules are very clear. The termination is mandatory. You don't have to tell them. Tell them it was just nausea. But you gave me something for it and it went away. This is my problem, not yours. If Oberson finds out that I concealed evidence of a pregnancy... See, I'm sorry, but these are the rules. I tried. I'm gonna give you a sedative. It'll make the procedure easier on you. I don't want the procedure! I want my baby! I can't do this! I can't do this! Anna, you don't have a choice. Now, if you like, you can take some time with this. But I need you to come back no later than tomorrow. Or I'll have no choice but to I can't click it. on myself. I'm sorry. Okay, thank God. No, I meant the fire on the wall. Find that doctor's body? Did you search him? Not yet. Well, what are you waiting for? Oh, the auto shop is where we're gonna find Molly again. I get it. It's all, it all makes sense now. She was real mad at him. Maybe she was pregnant too. This, Hannah. Guys, I missed click once. Like, what do you want me to do about it? It wouldn't allow me to, to, to fast skip. It was one missed click. I, I, I couldn't know. The first time, I took a tape and I put it in. So then I just clicked and it automatically did it for me. So it's like, yeah, it's just dumb. What the fuck is this strafe walking dude? Ah! The fuck? Pop him! He's clap. Gotta clap him, boys. Come here, motherfucker. Oh, yes, sir. Oof. This might be just what we need. Now, what's this? Looks like some kind of code. Vernon said the safe combination was only four numbers. Shit, time to go. Hmm, some kind of cipher. Wait, how, how did he get back here? Found another tape. This one's dated October 10th. That's the day after the first one we watched. Put it in. Oh, yes, I'll put it in. 
Have you made a decision? I thought you said I didn't have a choice. Well, technically you do. You can terminate the pregnancy or leave Crawford. Of course, that would be a death sentence for both you and your unborn child. Maybe that's best. I stayed up all last night thinking about this. Why are we even trying to survive? To keep on living? If this is what it takes. If this is what it's turned us into. I don't make the rules, Anna. Doctor, I'm begging you. Please help me. Maybe one day when things are different, you can try again. But for now, today, we have to do this. The fuck? No. Guys, no. What kind of stab was that? I think we know what happened to Crawford. More importantly, we got the combination. Mom. Krista, are you all right? What's wrong? It's nothing. That was just hard to watch. Don't worry about me. I'm fine. All right. Okay. Let's get those meds and get the hell out of here. We're in business. Is it clap? Antibiotics, morphine. We take as much of this as we can carry. Okay, I think we're good. This is more than enough for your people and mine. Let's go. You go on ahead. I want to make sure we didn't miss anything. I'll be right behind you. Don't take too long. Let's go. Yo, chill out, backseating Andes. Holy shit. Yeah, I need to lock her the whole time, dude. Chill out. Jesus Christ. Logan. This must have been his locker. A videotape? Put it in, dude. Tape number tres, boys. The fuck? Listen, as fun as this was, I have to put a stop to this little arrangement. This is the last I can give you. Why? Oberson had someone down here yesterday taking inventory. He's really cracking down. I just can't risk it. We had a deal. Yes, we had a deal. We don't anymore. My sister needs this medicine. Without it, she'll die, or she'll start showing symptoms, and they'll take her away. I can't let that happen. I'm sorry, Molly. I've done all I can, but I have to look out for myself here. Yeah, that's the Crawford way, isn't it? Pussy bitch. Well, shit. Okay, well, that changes uh, the things a little bit, boys. Jesus hey, Christ. Jesus! Shut up, me. Where the fuck have you been? Sightseeing. I'll take that battery now. Oh, yeah, uh, about that. I'm just kidding. Hey, good one. Did that was really good. I got you baited. Here you Can't. go. She swapped it. What's that? Nothing. 
You lied to me. What? You said you'd never been here before, but that wasn't the truth, was it? What? Who told you that? I saw you on a security tape. You were having an affair with that doctor. Hey, from what I've heard, you're not real big on the truth yourself. Besides, I didn't lie. I asked you how you knew about Crawford. You said you just heard stories. I said there were stories about Crawford. I never said that's how I knew about it. I never lied to you, and even if I did, so what? I don't owe you anything. You saved my life twice, but you can't tell me the truth? Are we really gonna do this now? I guess that's up to you. I used to live here with my sister. She was 14 years old. When the dead started walking and Crawford shut itself in, it seemed like a pretty good deal at first. We were safe. We had everything we needed to survive. Then the rules started coming down. No one who couldn't justify their place, earn their keep. No one who required special care. My sister was diabetic, and by Crawford's rules, that made her a liability. I kept it a secret. Kept her safe for as long as I could. But in the end, I couldn't protect her. That's when I got out. Crawford, they always talked about how their system worked. How anything was better than becoming one of them. But I saw what they'd already become. I just wish I could have seen it before it was too late. Before they came and took my sister away. Oh no! The bands! This is all I have left of her. I didn't have time to take it before I got out of Crawford. I just wanted it, okay? I don't care about your life story, Molly. Then maybe you shouldn't have asked. It's just that me and my people, we, we got our own problems, you know? Yeah, well, who doesn't these days? What the hell? I think that's our cue to get the hell out of here. Dude, we got to go, man. She's being edgy. Oh, Tough. Geez, geez. Sorry, sorry. Did I got it. spooked by those bells. And then I Cheap. heard someone coming. Did you leave Clementine alone? No, Kenny's with her. We still can't open that armory door. He sent me Cheap out to so and used to bust it open. I found this. Uh, then? Where did you get that? I just found it. It was stuck in the door handle at the end of the hallway back there. Shit. What a fucking idiot! Lee, shoot this fucker! Thanks. It wasn't me. Good going, kid. Nice. Job. Hey! Holy shit, Shroud! What is going on? They're coming. Oh shit. That ought to hold them. Sir, but now how do we get out? Through the armory. We can just get this damn door open. Let's Come go. on, damn you! They're still at the wooden door, literally. This is my fault, all my fault. The hell's he babbling about? Ben, we talked about this. No, wait. I want to know what he meant. What do you mean this is all your fault? Penny, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, man. Kid, this ain't the best time. Whatever you did, save it for later. I opened the door. Tell him. Let them in. Fine. Go ahead. Tell him. It's been me all along, putting all of us in danger. Katja and Duck, it was all me. It was all me. Wait a minute. What are you saying? It was me who made the deal with the bandits at the motor inn, slipping them supplies. I thought maybe I could keep them off our backs. When it got discovered, that's when they attacked. Peace out, Ben. When duck. Hey, hey, let him kick his ass. I agree with you. You should kick his ass. But now's not the time. You gotta focus on getting out of here. You little pissant! You're fucking dead. You hear me, Dad? My wife and child. You gotta both fucking kill. Can't let him. Not even kill him. You can whip his skinny little ass later, but right now we gotta go! Nice group you got here. Not the time, Molly. If this asshole thinks he's getting on my boat after what he did, he's out of his motherfucking mind! 
You hear me, shitbird? You can stay behind. Vote it. Fucking rot. I'm gonna get trouble. I know you're upset. I understand, but you don't get to make a decision like that on your own. We're all in this together. We're a group. Sure, take a vote. This is America. Fuck it. But before you all decide, there's something you ought to know. The boat's not big enough for all of us. Somebody's got to get left behind. Might as well be this piece of shit right here. Well, I vote we leave him. I'm sorry, Ben. I know you mean well, but all I want to do is get back to Omi, and you put that at risk. Wait, don't I get a vote? No. No. No, Megal. So what's your call, Lee? Does Ben go with us? I'm sorry, Ben. I've got to do what's best for the group. And that means cutting you loose. What about the rest of us? Don't we get a second? <laughs> Now can we go? Damn right. Vernon, come on! Oh, there goes the vote, boys. So much for the armory. What's left of it? A few rounds. That's it. You didn't close that door behind us? I could. The lock was busted. Great. Just fucking great. Come on. There's got to be a way out down here. Wait, Ben has all... What? What does Ben have all the fuel? Fuck! It's not gonna hold. Back upstairs! Oh, they're gonna be there. Yep. Yeah. Oh, shotgun! Lee, look! Mine now. Roll the... Roll the... Roll the... Oh no! Tapped! We, we, we have enough time. I shot! Your leg... Put it loose, man. Come on, dude. Holy shit. How hard can it be? One tap. Here we go, baby. Die, bitch! What's up? What's up, man? My hatchet! The hatchet! Come on! It's all right. I'm fine. Any way out of here? This leads to the roof. We might be able to find a way down from there. You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? Yeah. Why? Never mind. I can see the sewer where we came in from here. I think we can do this. Well, what are we waiting for? Go, go! Ben? Come on, let's go! Yeah! 
You can't be serious, right? And we get the save a bullet to you, Please. Feast. Krista? Everything okay? Oh, me! He died on the way in. Hold on. Is he dead? Krista, don't! Stay back! I never should have left you. I'm so sorry. Krista, get away from him. Uh. Hey. Back already? He's sleeping. We got you medicine. Good. Feel like I could use some. Oh, yes. Pills. Where's Ben? He didn't make it. What happened? Dumb son of a bitch nearly got us all killed. Lee stepped up and did what he had to. That's what happened. Oh no! She'll be okay. I know it's tough on her now, but she'll understand. I did what I had to. She will understand. Right? She's gonna have to if she's gonna make it in this world the way it is now. No easy decisions anymore. I'm gonna go start work on the boat. Okay, with a little luck, you should start feeling better pretty soon. I'll stay here for a few more hours to check on him. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks, Doc. Yes, thank you so much. Maybe now's a good time for you and me to have a little talk in private. He's not getting on the boat. Hey, I wanted to thank you for all you've done for us. Save your platitudes for someone who's buying it, huh? What? You don't think by now I got you figured? You don't strike me as someone who has a lot of consideration for others. What? Look at what you did to get me to come here with you in the first place. You expect me to believe you give a shit that it wound up costing Bree her life? Now, just hold on a damn minute. Listen. No, you listen. You got some good people here, and they look to you as their leader. Well, I'm here to tell you, the kind of leader you are, they're not gonna make it much longer. And you're kidding yourself if you think putting them all on a boat is gonna solve anything. Now, you may not care about all of those people, but I know you care about that little girl. True. Which is why I'm gonna make you an offer. I could just what kill kind of an offer? I'll take her off your hands, take her back with me to my people. We're well supplied, well hidden, and a lot of us <laughs> had kids of our own. And now Crawford's fallen, we got nothing left to fear from them. She'll be safe with us. Safer than she will be if she stays with you. Get the fuck out! That's what you want for her, isn't it? To be safe? I'm gonna pretend you didn't say any of this and give you a chance to walk away, which you ought to do right now. I know you think you're doing what's best for her. And if you were her real father, we wouldn't be having this conversation. But you're not. And staying with you is not what's best for her. If no one else around here will tell you that, then I will. That little girl's in my care. We've been through more together than you can imagine. Anyone who tries to get between me and her, anyone, is going to wind up dead. You hear me? Take Bitch. your hands off me. What's he going to do about it? We're as close to her father as he is to dying. Bitch.
Hey, going somewhere? She has a battery. Yeah, I'm about to head out. I, I just wanted to say thanks for everything. It's been fun. What are you talking about? Kenny's working on the boat right now. Thought you were coming with us. God knows you earned it. Yeah, I've been thinking it over. It's not for me. Sounds like it'd be pretty crowded, and I never did like the water. You sure about this? I'm sure. I've always done better on my own, anyhow. She's lying for sure. Listen, I'm not much for goodbyes. Tell the others for me. Sure. You take care of yourself, Molly. You too, Lee. It's not that she's very goodbyes. I think she just wanted. She just wanted to say like goodbye, like friendly, and then backstab them. You be sure to take care of that little girl. You know she thinks the world of you. Good luck. Ain't nothing to do with luck. Wait a bitch. Hey, sweet pea. Kenny's working on the boat. I know. What are we going to do after he fixes it? Where will we go? We'll go wherever Kenny says. He's a good captain, and he knows the water's down south. He'll know where to take us. Clem, honey, what's wrong? What happened to Ben? What did Kenny mean when he said you did what you had to? It won't do any good to dwell on it, Clementine. I want to know what happened. Ben was my friend. I liked him. I know, Clem. I did too. And maybe I could have done more to save him. But I had to think about the whole group. Not just one person. But I'm just one person. Not to me, you know. Before we leave tomorrow, will we have time to look for my parents? Yeah, sure. Uh, look before we leave. Smiley face. Really? You'll take me to Crawford so we can look? <sighs> I knew you didn't really mean it. Ah, shit. <laughs> Cut in my life, boys. <laughs> Give her a warm hug. Sorry. There was no way around the tears. She wanted her parents, and regardless of the answer, the ending was going to be not getting them. So she was going to cry anyway. So it is. <sighs> Clementine? No! Clementine? Wait, everybody's gone. The fuck? My boat! Clementine? My battery, my gas! Clementine! Oh god. The fuck? Dude, fuck these fucking things, dude. I'm 
so cheap, dude. No. No. It, it no. can't be. No. 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 Fuck. Lee? Lee? You out here? Ben? Lee? Are you crazy? What are you doing out here? Hi. It's safe. Lee? Where's Clementine? She's not in her room. Vernon ain't in the house either. What the hell is going on? Whose blood is that? It's a walker's. Fucker jumped me from behind. So where's Clementine? Clementine's gone. Fuck knows. I found her hat and her radio on the ground out here. That's all I found. There's no chance she just wandered off on her own? No. No way. Then who the hell took her? I don't know. Last night Vernon came to me and offered to take her with him. Said she'd be better off. Son of a bitch. I knew we couldn't trust that fucker. Wherever she is, I have to find her. Clem may not have much time. We have a better chance of finding her if we all go together. Who's with me? Lee, I'm sorry. We can't. It's too risky for us. Krista, come on. I know. But Lee's asking us to put our trust in him. And that's just too hard for me. What? I hope you understand. I really am sorry. I hope you find her. But you're gonna have to do it without us. Are you sure? Guys, I, I really need your help. We've made our decision, Lee. I'm sorry. I put them out of danger to get the, the tools for the boat, but they won't put them out of danger to get people on board. You know I care about Clementine. And I am a Christian man. And I keep asking myself, if this was me, Asking you for help? Asking you to put your life on the line? Would you be there for me? Because there have been plenty of times when you ain't been. Shut up, you mullet wearing prick. What the fuck? Fuck you. you. Kenny, go fuck yourself. You gonna let a little girl die because I didn't have your back every damn minute? Maybe you should grow the fuck up. Do whatever you want, asshole. You might not have been keeping score, Lee, but I sure as hell have. And you've been looking out for yourself more often than your friends. And then you lose your shit when they don't bend over backwards to help you? Well, fuck you! You're on your own now. I'll be damned if I'm gonna lift a finger. Then I guess that's how it's gotta be. Don't go alone. Don't expect me to wait for you. Once we get that boat out on the river, we're gone. Then I guess that's how it's gotta be. Good luck, Lee. I mean that. Yeah, man. Good luck. Thanks, man. You too. So did Grandpa steal her? Empty. <laughs> Fucking you. They gone. Where the hell are they? Vernon, get out here. There doesn't have to be any trouble here. All I want is the girl. Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt. Wait, what's happening? Clementine, are, are you alright? Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch!
What is that? It's not Bernard, if that's what you're thinking. Then you should really watch your tone. Clementine's fine. But if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully. Let's not, let's not. Okay, I'm hiding the game. Oh shit, wait. Let me show you the choice before. Okay. The boy in the attic. 74%. Kill the dude in the attic. Hippocratic Oath. Did you lie to the threatened Vernon? Yeah, of course, it would have done that. 32%. 74 is I had to choose to bring the girl in. 33. Let Ben felt his death, of course. Bite reveal. If you reveal your bite, 19%. Oh. That's nice. Who came with you? What? What is this? <laughs> okay. There's no way that the next episode There's no way that that the next episode has two choices. One for me only, and one for a grouped up. It's gonna be the same anyways. The ending doesn't matter. Guys, th there's no more result to the season. Pee break? I can, I, okay, everybody can go pee. Uh, I'm gonna eat my food since I did not eat the whole day, literally. I did not eat a single piece of food the whole day, so I'm gonna speed run it. Okay, everybody, one minute. I mean, cringe, you guys, I didn't do it on purpose. I'll try to eat as much as I can in one minute. All right? It's not about being edgy. Most of these choices make a lot of sense in survival mode. You guys are just kind of like being upset. Previously, on The Walking Dead. What if my parents come home and I'm not there? I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. Here, you can have some too. 
I think we should look for your parents. They always stay in the same place when they go there. The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? We gotta go! <laughs> yeah, why? Clementine? Clementine! Clementine's gone. Wherever she is, I have to find her. We have a better chance of finding her if we all go together. Who's with me? I hope you find her, but you're gonna have to do it without us. If this was me, asking you for help, would you be there for me? You know what, Kenny? Go fuck yourself. Vernon, get out here! There doesn't have to be any trouble here. All I want is the girl. Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt. Clementine, are, are you all right? Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch! No, Lee. Who is this? It's not Vernon, if that's what you're thinking. And you should really watch your tone. Clementine's fine. But if I were you... I choose my next words very carefully. What do you want from me? Whatever it is, I'll do it. You can let her go. I want you to never hurt anybody again. This isn't a kidnapping, Lee. Then what is it? Try to a rescue. What? Just hold on, Clementine. I'm coming for you. Damn. This is The Man on Fire, Volume 2. Can't those things let up for a fucking minute? You guys understand that movie before? Surgical supplies. I can't get my hands in between the doors. Oh, we need like a prior. How about the gun? Okay. Last one. What is that? Rib spreader. Spreading device. Grosses me out just looking at it. Looks like a car jack. I don't want to imagine this being used on a body. That's pretty disgusting.
Wait, no, we're turning him. Uh, am I a zombie now? No, no. Get out of here fast. Here we go. Eating, then's game. Here we go. One. Someone's gonna open the door. Two. Three. I'll just take my time. Ah! Fuck, dude. Chop it out! Jesus Christ! Mods literally just ban it. spoilers, and if there's like one or two, at just just in mode only mode. when things are damaged. Who goes there? Come on! One arm and he did. How they can put it back in? Huh? 
faster, man. What's on the left? What's here? No help. Help. Fuck. Must be thousands of them. I need to figure out a way to get down it. Somehow across town. Maybe head back towards the mansion and go after her from there. I don't like when things get damaged. Uh, it makes me want to like just not have them. So whenever whenever the main character has like a damaged arm, I just feel really bad. Like missing an arm, dude. Seriously. Look above, maybe. Ladder. It's an extension ladder. Bastard took a spill. What's that? He or she walked away from whatever accident happened. Well, that doesn't really mean much. Another ladder. That looks like Crawford Square over there. That looks like Crawford Square over there. Here's a way down. Damn. Damn. Can he not just... It leads down to the street. Can I do it? I don't understand it. It won't let me go. The last fellow who used it took a tumble. Footprints. Okay, let's just go back in. Hospital must have run out of doctors. <laughs> Not going back in there. It's a bell tower. Like the ones Molly used to draw the walkers around the city. No, he don't you. No way. It's higher than this roof for starters. Look at the cap. We could just put. We could just put the fucking we'll ladder there. Ahead.
We'll get the ladder then. Now, now we can probably unlock it. Yep. So everybody, that, everybody in chat, that saw me go over there and said fellfish, right? Whenever I then go, you were wrong. Damn it! I hope you feel better. It's not the time to fall on your fucking face again. Here we go. Idiot. Walkers are all headed this way. Gotta get out of this tower. I think it's over, chat. It's time. I think you have to jump. God damn. I got this. Got this. Let's go, got boys. This motherfucker. Come on. You. Oh, oh shit. Okay. Time to go. Let's go, baby. Wait, wait, we roll it. Clap. Those are my friends who uh, let me behind it. it. Oh, that's action. Right. See you on the boat, motherfuckers. Okay, well, they came all at me. What the f They fucked us. So how was the how was the cruise? It was burning. They were waiting for us and jumped us. They were armed and just fuck. Did they have Clementine? No, definitely not. She's not with you? She's with someone else. Her parents were in Savannah, and I think someone used that against her. Well, we're going after her, right? Yeah, of course. Wait, what the hell happened to you? Cut it off. Seriously? I was bitten. What? It was an accident. Small, stupid thing. But yeah. Oh my god. Before we split up? Yes. You fuck her! God, we would have gone with you! I lived through it. Wait, what? Which is a start. And, well, uh... I thought it might buy me some time. You know, get that bite off my body? Hopefully whatever's gonna happen takes longer. Oh, God. Everything just... <sighs> Oh, 
Omid, can you go over the fence and let us into the backyard? We shouldn't be out in the open. Yeah. This is not happening. Everything is so fucked. Clementine is still out there. So we get Clementine, and then what? We get the fuck out of cities. I'm done with cities. We go into the countryside and make a go of it. I don't want to go back out there again. Then don't. Go your own way. You're every man for himself until you and your boyfriend actually need something. You wouldn't have had a boat to lose without us. So shove it, okay? Sure. Krista's right. Boat was a pipe dream. We still go after Clem, and then we get out of Savannah and rethink our entire plan. Rethink? How about we just think for once? That's what I'm saying we do. Calm down, Kenny. We can do this in the yard. I expect an apology. What do you think, Lee? What do we do now, without a boat? Well, I know you two are just gonna look out for number one. And number two, you know, yourselves. It's not like that, man. Find a small town. Maybe one that hasn't been ripped up too bad. At some point, people are gonna have to start rebuilding. And you guys and Clem should be part of that. I don't know. Lee's right, Krista. We've been so goddamn scared of strangers for so long, but at one point, we gotta take our chances, right? This is bullshit. You might not even be around, so... With all due respect, Lee, his opinion doesn't carry a lot of weight. Hey, it's still his little girl out there. She's number one. That's the end of that, okay? But what about... Oh, shit! Here they come! In the house! They shouldn't be able to get into the backyard, right? Maybe not. We can secure this place. Krista! Weapons. Search the house for weapons! On it. Kenny! Put sure. anything you can up against the doors and windows. That's what I was thinking. Omi! What is it? Front doors! Front doors! Get your dirty hands off my face! Lee! Help! Cut their fucking arms off! There's gotta be a knife or something in there! Hurry! Bunch of life. Take their goddamn arms off. One. Two. Three. Fingers. Now what? This Holy is a big sturdy house. It'll hold. Yeah, I think so too. <laughs> Shit! Get upstairs! Go! Smart thinking, boys. Huge brain. It's the cow! Guys, help me with this!
Why do they make? Well, that could have gone better. Everyone okay? Lee's still bitten. Shut up. Okay. Let's get out of here and keep moving. Kid's right. We gotta keep moving. Think there's any chance we get Clem and catch up to those goddamn thieves? I don't know. Maybe. Well, we're not going out through this window. No latches, no roof access, and 30 feet straight down. Anyone have any ideas? I bet this guy would. He's got a resourceful air about him. Knock it off. Dixon Kent the Third, Industrial... Mead? Krista. Just trying to lighten the fucking tone. We need solutions, not stupid jokes. I'm sorry. He's kind of a bitch. So, no ideas then. There's gotta be another way. Check the floor for any other access, a vent, anything. Or we wait for the house to clear out and stick to the high ground. <coughs> oh no. Hey, you're not looking great. And you're warm. The infection. I'm okay. Don't. What did that mean? She's at the hotel, where her parents were staying. He hasn't moved her. Yet. Yeah. Yet. We need to start thinking about more than just Clementine when it comes to our... urgency. What do you mean? How do we get out of here? That's the whole point. We don't know. Okay, now your life depends on it. How do you get out of here? I don't know. I don't get it. I do. We have to go now. Like right this goddamn minute. Where, Lee? Come on. We're trapped. Do you think that worked? I don't know. I hope he so. doesn't know, does. I think we need to have an adult conversation about what happens if Lee takes another spill. Hey, look. We could be looking at a Larry situation here. Who's Larry? It don't matter. He looks fine to me. We don't need to talk about it. I think we do. I said we don't. Guys, I don't know what happened before Omid and I showed up, but we can cross this bridge when we get to it. Lee, I'm not advocating anything here, but how is this not a thing? We're all so worked up about Clementine that we're forgetting what the fuck happened to you. My arm is not the issue. I'm not the problem. The 500 walkers in the house and no door in this room are the goddamn problem. Yeah, maybe at the moment, but who's to say when it becomes an issue? At that point, there may not be any time left to deal with it. This is getting out of hand. You're gonna listen to me. We will get Clementine back, with or without you. Because I haven't given up everything to die because we were stupid. I'm, I'm sorry. sorry, okay? Fuck, we can't do this! We're gonna have to. Okay. Ah! Jesus. Oh, dude's face. Shut up, sweetie. Look. It's corroded to hell. It's rotten. What's on the other side of this wall? A 30-foot drop? No. This mansion butts up against the one next door. Oh, they... <laughs> this wall ain't shit. Is this really possible? Did it, they make the game with one arm, open the attic, cut people's arms, break the wall, holy yeah, shit, dude. We can do this. Okay. We'll work in shifts. Omid, Krista, and I. Lee, you rest. We have to work fast. I wasn't gonna hurt you. Sure, pal. I know. Pal. The audio is all weird right now. I can't believe you didn't tell us you were bitten. You True. couldn't do anything anyway. No, except make sure Clementine had someone coming for her that wasn't liable to die on the way there. I wasn't gonna let that happen. I'm sure that's what that Larry guy or whoever said. He wasn't bitten. It was different. You were scared. I don't blame you. I would be scared shitless. It's so weird. I keep doing a double take on your arm, expecting it to be there. 
I'm hoping whatever's in their bite is gone, too. What do you think the odds are of that? I don't know. I know everyone's wondering. Even if it just slows down the process, I'd be happy. You don't mean that. So when we get this guy, what do you think? We make sure he never takes anybody from anyone again. You pop the cap in his ass. Who's got enough evil in it? And, you know, whatever happens to you, I'll... Seriously, can we not talk like that? I was bitten, Krista. You cut it off. What good is it to plan around that work? What good is it for you to give up? I haven't given up. I want you guys to take her. Stop it. I'm serious. She'd be safe and relatively happy with you two. We're not doing this right now. Krista, listen to him. It's what I want, okay? All right. I'm out of gas. You look good and rested. Sure. If you don't count an infected leg. You want me to do it? Nah, and you can hop in after me. Shouldn't be long now. It's good we're forced to take a breath. Uh, that, uh, feeling any better? Still feels pretty recently chopped. So no, Kenny feels about as, uh, good as you'd expect. I mean, do you think it worked? Did it, did it help at all? Nope. I feel like a man who got bitten. So, take that for what it's worth. Heard you guys giving Lee some hell about hiding his bite. Yeah, of course. I'd have done the same thing. How are you? I'm... Uh, I don't know how to answer that. I'm sorry. You've lost more than any. Stop crying, you pussy. Beta. I'm just asking him how he is. Lee's right. Your boyfriend's making decent progress. You need to be ready to move. I agree. I just wanted to say, you've all lost a lot. We're still here, though. This guy tell you much about what we've been through? Bits and pieces. Before y'all, we had this woman, Lily, with us. Lord knows where she is now. Anyway, we had to make some tough calls with her dad. She came between Lee and I pretty good. And I spent a lot of nights hating this guy's guts. After everything, he's still a bastard, you know, Ken? Been hearing that my whole life, Doc. Well, cheers. What up? Drink up! Ooh! We're getting the juice tonight, boys! I'm through! No walkers. Things are looking up. Everyone keep a goddamn eye out. This place seems pretty sealed off. Well... Who is this? Damn. Put the hands. Loot the gun. People we've seen go. They got to do it their own way. Together. Don't you say that. You stick it out as long as you can. You do whatever you have to. 
I could have done more. We all could have done more. Myself included. I could have been a better husband. Better father. Could have been a better friend. So let's figure out a way out of here. Get that little girl. Hell yeah. We should move. Yeah. Got at least one shot left. Let's clear the room before we move on. What about the chamber? Okay, figure Come out on. where we're headed. If he sees one bullet in the mag, there's one in the chamber, right? I've seen enough movies for this shit. Hard to believe the world once felt this peaceful. What do you call this thing? A mirror? Art? Hey, thanks, dude. It's sick, but think of all the pain they avoided. What? Well. Nothing other than personal items in here. Looks like we can stay off the streets all the way to River Street if we're careful. Let's go. Let's go down, boys. Of course, the person that only has one hand goes first. <laughs> Jesus. Mr. Pillar. Going. Be careful up here. Yeah, can climb that, right? Sammy, be quiet a little bit, please. They're yelling, yo. It's good to be moving. You're doing good. I'm not, but I'm trying, man. What happened? Honestly. You know how many nights Kat and I laid in that broke-down RV? And she'd give me hell for not thinking enough about the rest of you. All of them. Every damn night. You got that walkie-talkie? Yeah, of course I do. You might want to give him a call and tell him we're coming for him. Yeah, right. Careful, Cross, here. Oh, this is gonna break for sure. That it. Here it comes. Right here. River Street's just up ahead. Nope. Maw of darkness full of walkers? Fuck that shit. See any down there. You can hear them, right? We're all desensitized to it, but I can still smell them. Let's keep going, you bunch of lollygaggers. <clears throat> You're so fucking stupid. Oh, fuck. <sighs> well, I'm so sorry. Leave it. We don't need it. You got a beat on this guy. Yeah, I agree. And when we don't? And when we don't know where to begin to look, any clue, even the smallest one, is invaluable. We need that thing. Fuck, I'm sorry. Let's think this through. I just did. Krista! Jesus fucking Crazy Christ. witch. I got it. Get me up. Fuck, we can't reach. Find something, fast. Why didn't they think about that? Good. Keep a fucking eye on her. Think about that before, maybe? One of the planks out there.
need something sturdy. Can you jump? I am jumping. Won't help. Sure, that's fine. Grab onto this. We'll pull you up. Good. Thanks. Oh, uh, grab onto my pipe. Why am I the one doing it? I have one arm! Ah! Uh, oh. Jump! Jump up here, baby! Let's go! Jump! <sighs> Me and my fucking mouth. Oh, oh no! Boy. Get her, Ken! Can't just said all that shit and not do something now. Come on, reach! I got you, hun! Save her! Go, go, go! Do you fucking hear me? Kenny! Jump! Up here, Ken, I'll grab you! Where is he? Get the fuck off me! Go! We're going in after him! We can't! We have to! Lee! No! Where, where'd he go? Maybe, maybe he ran. Maybe, maybe the man's all right. Maybe he'll find us. What if he doesn't? He went down there for you. I know he did. He... Why is she such a bimbo? Marshall Hotel is around the corner of the block. Are you okay? Do you want to talk? Fuck up too clear. It's Kenny to answer for, too. Keep a clear head, Lee. We wouldn't be out here. We'd all been together to defend against Vernon. And we'd be out on the water. Everyone would be alive. This is a shitty time. I want to make sure we're clear before we go forward. What is it? Now with Kenny, gone. Means Omid and I have to stay safe. For her. Just take care of her as long as you can. Then find her a family that's capable. We're capable. You and your girlfriend might want different things. That's enough. Fine, but you hurt me. She'll be fine, Lee. We have to cross here. Well, at least it doesn't look like a death trap. Who's going first? You're the lightest. He's got a busted leg, and you're walking for two. I'm obviously not doing so hard. Decision doesn't make itself. I'll go. I'll go first. In case anything happens out there. You sure? Yeah.
Jesus, dude. Just go nice and slow. That's not very hard. That'd be hard for a guy with only one hand, though. Killer Andy. Just go, dude. Just go across, dude. Almost there. It's an easy crossing. Good. Going for it. Going for it? What does that mean? It means I'm already bitten. I just have to push my way through. What the fuck? But maybe you got to it fast enough. Maybe you'll be fine. I can't risk losing more time on a long shot. Find me when you get down. What the fuck does that mean? It means what it sounds like. Hotels around the corner. Find Clementine and me as soon as you can. You're crazy! There's no other way. Goodbye, friend. Just act like them. He goes in. Find one more. It's a one slice. Can he do more? Five on the board so far. Six kill. Seven. Can he do eight? Gets the eight kill. Relentless moment. Nine. Ten K. Oh, champ! It's rigged. The room is rigged. I got us adjoining rooms. Hello. Okay. This is civil. You look horrible. And you're missing an arm. Go over there. Okay. Don't go over there. Don't show 
put your things down. Let me out! Who's out there? Quiet, please, sweetie. Sweetie? Your things. There. I don't have anything on me. Really? You got all the way here without any weapons? Lost them. I don't believe you. Seriously? You don't believe me? Go ahead. Search me. No, I'm not touching you. Just sit down. Do you know who I am? Yeah. I know who you are. You saw my car. Out front, then. You see anything else you want in there? Not a whole lot left. I didn't take from you. Your people didn't? I didn't agree with it. That's what Clementine said. Why didn't you? It wasn't right. It wasn't our stuff. That's real good of you. Look, what do you want me to say? I don't want you to say anything. I want you to know what happened. Have you ever hurt somebody you care about? No. Yes. Yes, of course. Who? Yeah, Mom. My wife. Clementine said she wasn't with you. <laughs> I heard her a long time ago. How? Um. In a lot of ways. She traveled for work. I didn't like that. I wanted a family. A reasonable thing to want. So we fought, and it made my biggest fear come true. Got sick one day on my way to class, canceled it and went home. Found her there with someone else. Killed him. Clapped. I was mad at her for so long, and I can't imagine how much pain she felt. How about you? He killed her mom. I hurt her. So bad. My son Adam went missing. I took him out hunting even though my wife said he was too young. I figured he had to learn. I came back without him and the look on her face said, You are a monster. So? We all went out looking for him. We never found him. I hurt her so bad. And then we came back, and all our stuff was gone. <laughs> Your people, Lee. That asshole in the ball cap. His stupid fucking wife. I could have earned her trust back if they hadn't made our situation so desperate. Fucked up. The hungrier we got, the more she blamed me. Until she finally took our daughter Elizabeth and left. They didn't get far. I found them a day later in the road. Oh no. Do I look like a monster to you? No. I'm not like you. You killed a man with a pitchfork right in front of a little girl. I did what I had to. You lied to her about who you really are.
Wasn't the right time to tell her. You brought her to the most dangerous place in this city where she could have died! No, she didn't. That's not the whole story. The whole story?! How could you know all this? You're a monster. You're a murderer and a thief. And I'm gonna hurt you so bad. I'm not a thief. I'm my thief. I didn't steal from you! But think of everything else you did. After I found Clementine on my radio, I wasn't even mad at you. I was coming for the others. For revenge. But the more I heard about the things you did, and the danger she was in, our plan changed. Lead, listen to me. I need you to hear this before what happens next. I can take care of her. We can have a family. I bet you don't even know how old she is. She's eight. Wrong. She's nine. But... Her birthday was six days ago. I know how to be a dad, you know. She wouldn't be exposed to what she has been with you. No, no. no. Shut up. It makes sense. It's not happening. You'll have to kill me. Yeah, I know. Hey, honey, I think this is all going to work out. What are you? I'm glad to. I wish it wouldn't have had to get this bad, but it's all over, hon. Isn't it? Just about. I hate seeing you like this. I just miss your smile, honey. I miss you so much, Tess. You're gonna like Clementine a lot, though. She's not Lizzie, but she's sweet. She wouldn't hurt a fly. <laughs> Fuck, Don! Fuck you! <laughs> Get fucked! No, thank you. Tackle. Headbutt. Strangulation. Fuck! Son of a bitch. Just go away! No, thank you. Die! Pog champ. I, I, I. It's okay. It's okay. I. Your arm's gone. Why? So scary. I had an accident. We'll talk about it somewhere safe. You don't smell good. Oh, yeah, that's. I <laughs> Did he hurt you? No, not really. I'm sorry, Lee. Cleo, it's okay. Need to get you somewhere safe, and then we have to talk, okay? Yeah. Everything's okay now. We need to figure out how to get out of Savannah as fast as we can. Pull the 
trigger. Hell yeah. I, I know. I wish. I wish you'd never had to learn that. Me too. Dead sucker. Which way out? Through there. Just go there. The fuck? Savannah. He's gonna chop it all up and then he's gonna roll in blood. Chop him up. Oh no. Come on. Open bar, boys. Necklace? A nice necklace. Some ice. And gang. That's not bad. Smear. Are you done? No more. I want to be sure. Some more uh, smearing. There. That should do it. I hope so. And you're missing something. I thought it was gone. I thought you were oh, gone. That's so sweet. Thank you. Stay right next to me. Walk very slowly. Don't look around. And don't panic. Mm -hmm. I'll keep you safe. What's in the bag? Don't touch me. It's working. Is there still are there still a lot of spoilers that I could have an egg right now? Yeah, I can. Jesus. What is that? <laughs> Mommy? Out. Please wake up. Please don't be dead. 
please, no. Oh no, he took me. He's starting. I was so scared. I, I, I thought you loved me. I, I, I saw my parents. Come here, sweet pea. They're dead. They really are. As fast as we can. Well, we can't. There's thousands of them outside. We have to. I'll protect you. We'll push no, through. No, no, that's crazy. I saved you. We're safe here. I locked us in. Get that door open. I can't. Do it. His eyes are turning yellow. It was only a little open when I found it. I closed it to keep us safe. Come on. Pull on three. One, two, three! See? Clementine, honey? No. My arm is gone because I cut it off. Why would you do that? Because I was bitten, Cleo. Please, no. No. Th that's not true. Yes, it is. <sighs> it's gonna be okay. You are gonna be okay. We just have to think and work together. Okay. We gotta brute force at the door, boys. Brute force it. I think there might be a way out over there. Uh. Good, good girl. Let's go. Uh, I might be a little slow. Uh. I'll help you. No, you can't. You're not, she's I not helping. You, you can lean on me if you have to. I'm okay. I'm okay. I thought I was helping by bringing you in here. You're like nine pounds. Oh, you did, honey. It's awful out there. Well, they would have chewed me up. It was hard. I don't know how you did it, but you did good. Okay? Keep going. We're almost there. <laughs> Get up, Lee. The door is right here. Come on. You can do it, Lee. Don't give up. <sighs> oh. I can't. You have to. Liam, I can't move. This is it for me here. It's please, not. please, try to get up. I can't. You don't have much time. You gotta do something. Fast. here as soon as you can. I, I can't leave you. Just work on getting out, okay? We'll figure it all out. Don't worry. Just start by getting that door open. It's locked. It's uh. no big deal. It's just a glass window. Whoa. Oh, Watch no. with your hand. No, Bobo. We'll get you in there. Don't worry. You are doing good. You can do it. Keep pulling. It might give. <laughs> that window. Just regular glass. 
baseball bat. There's a baseball bat under the counter, Clem. You can use that. Use the bat to shatter that window so you can reach in, okay? Okay. There it Watch goes. out for broken grass. Broken grass. Good job. I hear it. Don't be afraid of him, honey. You're smart. He is it. You're smarter than all of them. The way out's through there, Clem. I know. Don't be scared of the walker. You'll be fine. Grab the chair, Clem. Use it to reach in to the lock. Goodbye. Open it. He's, he's trapped. This will be easy then. He's got keys. Probably to that door. And everything you'll need. Really good. You're almost there, honey. It's keys and a gun. You're gonna need both of those. The handcuffs on the ground. Get them. Oh no. Okay, me. Should have time you to the radiator. The vase. The fuck? Ow! The bat, Clem. Get the bat. Jesus, chill out. You got smoked. Poor oh, champ. I got him. Come here. Just for a second. Sweet pea. Oh no. Just 
strong, Clem. You... You can do anything. But I'm little. Doesn't mean nothing. You're gonna see bad stuff, but... It's okay. My parents... It's so horrible. I, I can't imagine, sweet pea. And now... You... Please... Please don't be one of them. Please don't become a walker. There's only one thing you can do. You know that. I don't know if I can. You have to shoot me, honey. Lee, no. It's yes. okay. It's okay. Clem, I was standing over Doc holding that gun. It was so hard. Sorry you're in that position now. I'd give anything for you not to be. But you just have to point it at me. Close your eyes and be thankful you never have to see me as one of them. You can do it. I know you can. Okay, Lee. I can do it. Be I, I can. It's gonna stay bad out there until it gets better. But it will. One day. Until then, though, no. I don't trust anyone. You have so much more growing up to do. People will see how small you are and try to take advantage of you, try to get you to do things you shouldn't. I won't let them. <laughs> I will. I'll cut it myself. Great. Good. And also... What? What is it? Seventy-one percent of pledge remove your arm. Lost temper. Seventy-five percent of pledge lost your temper. Change true. This armor gave up weapons. Forty percent. Nice. That's decent. Stranger killed. Clinton's captor. Fifty-seven. Goodbye. Stopped Lee from turning. Sixty-three. So that was a kind of like a normie run at the end there. Wait, what is this? Hold up. Blame them for Sean's death of pharma. Defend his son. Oh! Are those the inconsistencies in my story? Or am I, um... My choices. Because these are kind of, um... You know.
blamed him for showing up at the farm and defended his, his son. Killed his son so he didn't have to. He was lost at the Hurtron Civic. Yeah, so we're, we're, we're like kind of decent with it. Voted to throw Ben out of the group. He dropped Ben in the tower. Fuck that guy. And trust Richard Path at first. Saved her life at the cost of another. I mean, she's hot. Defended her against Lily's decision. She was killed by Lily. Nothing could have done there. Nothing could have done there. You helped her get into the train. You hid your bike from her. After getting separated, you told her to find uh, you. You asked her and omitted to take care of Clementina. True. You were with him when you found your brother. He died when Walker attacked a drugstore. You argued that he was not bitten back in Macon. You let him be your sidekick, solve the mystery. You shoot him before you could turn. True. <laughs> Hit or miss. I guess I never miss, yeah. You got a boyfriend. <laughs> Who's there? 